Hello, everybody. Welcome. Welcome to the beginning of Ace Attorney 2. Justice for all. I hope you guys are ready because I'm extremely ready. I'm, I'm so, so, so ready. I'm so excited. I've been waiting so patiently because I didn't want to start this right after we played Ace Attorney 1. But then I'm like, but I really want to play it. <laughs> Then we have a problem. I want to play the game, but I don't want to play the game. I just didn't want to rush um, and, and just play, you know, straight Ace Attorney for like a few months and that's it. <laughs> we had to add some like Peach in there and all that. So we beat Peach. And now we're here and I'm so excited. Could you guys tell? <laughs> Let me just get my uh my grass on. Thank you guys for the hydrant and the nut. Let me get that really quick. Nut. 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 Um. Bah! Hello. Hello! Explodes into a million! No, not a million! I can't put you back together if you're a million pieces! How was I supposed to do this? Chad, I need help. <laughs> I need help. I can't put- I can't put it back together. No! <laughs> oh, a little ab. Hello, oh, Ame. Also, congrats, Ame. I'm gonna congrats Ame really quick because... Uh, oh my god, affiliate! Hell yeah! Make sure you go so show some uh, support to Ami. Um, we've been working hard trying to get stuff ready for um, affiliate, and you should definitely go check them out. And the Autumn! Thank you for the stretch as well. I didn't even see that. Thank you. Hello, Gral, Arisia. Hello. Oh, ba, 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 ba. Hello, Ambient. Welcome. Hello, Korgoth. Hello, Liss. They're all Legos. You can do it. I believe in you. Do you have an instruction manual? By chance. <laughs> if you do not have an instruction manual, I don't know if I can do that. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see. Um, but... Legos, Kyron, but no! Uh, no, don't eat the Lego. That's really bad. You can't. You're gonna choke and die. Then what? I'd be really sad. <laughs> Girl, think of a 20 months in the 20 month streak. Holy cow! Nice. Got that streak going. Oh my god, that's so long too. I think, I think every time you now have a add to the streak, I'm gonna be like, wow! Because it's, <laughs> it's now at the point where I'm like, oh my gosh, you, you've just been really keeping on top of things. I'll be really bad about myself, but I'll be back soon, Tia, I promise. On the worries. No worry, no worry. Um, Speaking of subs, uh, for anyone who does not know or wants a reminder or needs a reminder, uh, we're doing a tier 3 thing, uh, where if you subscribe at tier 3, uh, you'll be helping me a shit ton, um, where it will very much contribute to the 60-40 split. Uh, I will be doing a headshot drawing, um, which I'm slowly kicking out. Um... But if you subscribe at tier 3, I will make you a headshot drawing of your character. And... Meow! Meow, 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 meow. I don't have any examples at the moment. I can show off, um... Hold on. I can do this. I can do this. I can show off what I did recently. Because I feel like, um... What am I looking for? <laughs> Image. Im yug. Im, im yug. Im yug. I'm a g I'm a I'm mama. I'm uh, because I think I did uh, Rusia's and Vexing's um, since last time. Since last time I showed them off and stuff like that. 
Ooh, it turned crusty when I made it super tiny. Uh, <laughs> let me show off vexings really quick uh, while we're here. Uh, root jump scare. Ah, 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 oh, yeah. Oh, <laughs> I'm trying to get the same size. Ooh. There we go. They still look a little crusty, but it's fine. They're just they're just really tiny. I didn't want to make them too uh, big and they'd cover everything. Um, maybe I'll make it there. It's not covering my face completely. <laughs> Fur, welcome in. So if you would like. Yeah, cat girls. I got some cat girls. Uh, if you would like a headshot drawing like this. Um. Think about subscribing to Tier 3. Uh, think of it as a extremely good deal. Because a drawing like this normally would probably cost like 50 bucks. Um, so you can spend your money for $25 and get one. Um, and yeah. Meow, meow, meow. Meow, meow, meow. I'm trying to make them... Mm. <laughs> trying to make them a little bit gore. <laughs> Um, but I had a lot of fun making these. Um, it's also like really good drawing practice as well. Um, and you guys help support me. Uh, so it's very much appreciated. Colin, welcome in. I hope you're having a good day. They look very good. Yeah. And if you, uh, subscribe every month, uh, I will be doing a new drawing every single month. Um, I'm be spending tier three for six months in advance. <laughs> oh my gosh, six months. <laughs> Thank you, I appreciate it. I hope, um, we can get, um, the 60-40 split. Um, wait, what? <laughs> Why is the goal flashing, being like, we're halfway there! Th I think it was like a, a little late with Graz Sub, I don't know. <laughs> that was so weird, what the heck? Um... But hopefully we can get the 64 split before, um... Uh, maybe I, before I, you know, completely, like, either burn out, or... <laughs> oh, hi! Mar! Fur! Thank you for the tier three! And thank you for subscribing for seven months! Uh, be sure to DM me on Discord. Um... And give me a reference of you. Uh, and I can get that punched out as fast as I can. Um, I still have Alexis to do, and I got Phoenix. I'm pretty sure that's... Yeah, I'm gonna double check, because I don't... I don't wanna... Oh, and Patty! I got Patty as well. <laughs> so, now I got you too. Um, but I think with your... Tier three, we might be like halfway to a hundred. Um, I don't want to lie. <laughs> I do want to check. Um, does it tell me? No. Why doesn't it tell me? What the fuck? No. No. Hold on. I'm gonna check. I'm gonna check for you guys. Cause that way, if you guys don't want to scroll down or anything like that. Um, or if you can't, or etc. etc. I just want to make sure. Uh, we're almost halfway. We're 37 out of 100. We're almost halfway. So, if you haven't uh, already and you would like to subscribe, you have to show your support. Even a tier one is enough. Um, it helps a lot. Angie Misty noises. I meant to go pick her up, but then I forgot. Here. Yeah. Hopefully my mom doesn't go nuts again. And I've got a really good clip of last time I was doing Ace Attorney. And it was me just going brrrr and <laughs> just rapid fire all over the place. Uh, which is on my Twitter if you have not seen it already. Um, I posted it for today's stream. Um, so yeah. Uh, also, Kate, welcome in. I hope you're doing well. Please equip the Misty. She has been equipped. I stole my quote for a clip name. <laughs> for the clip name. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> I forgot to see the, the title. What is it? Tell me, tell me, tell me, tell me. 
Um, 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 uh. Yes, but she's been equipped. She's now currently rubbing all her face, all of the face, against the table. And we're just gonna let her, let her do that. <laughs> let her get out of her system before she lays back down. She was so good last night, she slept with me. I was surprised. I went, I was gonna go to bed last night. I went to bed kind of late. Whoops. Um... Well, I think she was tired of waiting for me. So she actually went to my bed and slept... Um... In my bed before I got there. When I went to go to my bed and sleep, I would like, you know, lift over the... Lift open... Lift, lift open? Uh, lifted up the blankets and then I heard a... <laughs> and I was like, what? And it was Misty. Uh, she scared me. Uh, I was not expecting her to be in my bed. Or she was like not in the cover, she was on top. I just didn't see her because she blends in very well. Um So I just completely missed her. <laughs> um meow, 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 meow. But how is everyone doing today? I hope everyone is having a, a good day. I hope everyone having a good weekend as well. Stealth mode. She's so secretive. She's moving her face like crazy. <laughs> Imagine my panels right here are the table. She's just... <laughs> oh my god, now she's doing it to my hand. Oh my gosh, you're wet. What? Your nose is so wet? Oh my gosh. Now my sleeves are covered in fur. Really likes that table. She's just really good scratching post for her. Okay. I think this is a great time. She drooling? No, I think her nose is just wet. She just rubbed it all over me. Wet and cold. What up, what up? Hey, Catfish! Welcome in. Uh, how are you doing? I'm going to, I think, switch over. Missy's laying down. This is a perfect time to get into the game. Good day off today. Let's go! Hell... Yeah! Let's go, let's go. Torgo burr. Ah, Torgo burr. Every time I think of go burr, I always think of KDA. <laughs> like, <laughs> Kelly, go girl. <laughs> Drake, welcome in. I hope you're having a good day, a good weekend. <laughs> chat, please work. Please work, chat. This is like the gamble every single time I switch over. <laughs> every time it doesn't show up. I don't know why it does that. I don't have it set to refresh or anything. It just doesn't want to appear sometimes and... and blah, 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 blah. Yay, it works. <laughs> Every time, it's like that little jump scare. Jump, oop, jump scare. Jump scare. Uh, also, you might have noticed if you... I mean, if you haven't noticed, I'm going to tell you. Um, but... If um, you noticed my schedule, if you looked at my schedule this week, you may notice that Jack and Dexter is not there. If you were not here on Friday, uh, my capture thing broke completely. Um, I don't know why. I don't know if it's the wire. Uh, I put a new wire on my throne. Um, I, I will see if that is the problem. This is literally the only difference right now of what's, like, you know, going to the console to, you know, that to the Elgato to the computer. Um, there shouldn't be a reason why that's breaking unless there's something, like, wirely wrong with that, uh, and because obviously my switch is working, um, the Elgato is fine. <laughs> um, so there will be no more uh, Jack and Dexter for the foreseeable future. Replace Jack and Dexter with Bug Snacks. That is true. Bug Snacks is coming. It did get shipped. So soon to you. It seems like equipment is breaking for a lot of people lately. I don't know why. I wish I knew, because I, 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 I don't know, I'm just really sad, um, because, I don't know, that's like, I had the PS3 as an option for games, and now it's just not a thing anymore, uh, so that really sucks, uh, meh, I, and I, and like I said, I don't know why, <laughs> this is just a guess of me thinking it's the cord, because it's the only added factor, um, a yar. Yar 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 yar. They're dead. She killed them. I, 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 
I didn't mean to. I didn't want to do it. Elgato catcher cards sound like they're broke too much. I That's the thing. I don't know if it's the catcher card because it's like, obviously it's working. So, <laughs> I don't know. I, I wonder if they push something out that caused some um, obsolete in capture cards. Like I said, my capture card is working. I don't think it's the capture card unless it's like, you know, that's the thing. The PS3 was working fine for like, mm, for Sly Cooper. It was working for this. It, I don't know why it died now. Like, mm, I don't know. All it is is just a thing that, you know, makes the PS3 go to the Elgato. That is it. It is not like a another device. Well, I guess it is a device. <sighs> uh, I don't know. <laughs> that being said, um, like I said, uh, a new one's on the throne. We can try it. Um, if Space tour is high someday it happens, but Spacey tour streamer Spacey forty seven peak Spacey forty seven tail. Rodan, thank you for subscribing with Prime, and thank you for the fourteen months. I appreciate it. And thank you for the lurk as well. You know what I found out? You want to know what I found out about the plus points? I think I might have said it already before. Primes don't count. Why? Why? What's the point? What? Why? You like Twitch? I don't like you. <laughs> Twitch, I do not like you. <laughs> bad, bad Twitch. I'm gonna freaking get a newspaper, roll the newspaper, and just start smacking Twitch. I. <laughs> Guy, dang it, we're gonna continue the game. Why do you do this? I, that, oh, whoops. We need to start a new game. Justice for all. Man, I can't wait to get the Trials and Tribulations. I feel like I've heard a lot of good things about the third game. And I don't know why. I do not know, I've not looked up anything. I don't know anything. Uh, plus. Um, so I'm trying to get, um, to, uh, the 6040. Uh, split from Twitch. Um, and they're called plus points. Um, and it only counts if someone subscribes. Gift subs do not count. And primes do not count, unfortunately. So it's just like, come on, Twitch, please. <laughs> you make this very difficult. Uh, so we are starting the second game. <laughs> I think and hope you'll love Trials and Tribulations. Oh, I want to get there so bad. We have to get to this. Is this game shorter than the first game, by chance? Because I know the first game had that long ending trial. Um, or is it about the same? A part of me wants to get to uh, Trials and Tribulations. But like, I'm like, this is probably going to take longer. <laughs> And then, and then it's coughing. It's only four cases. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That scares me. Kentucky, also welcome in. I hope you're doing well. Sorry for the late hello, but hello. Cough. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. Remember, this will override your save points from the previous game. So if you don't want to lose your progress on the first game, Keep a save from the first. I don't think I care too bad. Um, there's not... It's not like there's... Anything worth saving. Like, you're not going back. I mean, if you if you really want me to, I can just... Because, uh, like, the thing is, you can start at any episode, right? So, like... Eh. I don't know. You'll have all the information regardless and stuff like that. Russia! Thank you for the- also the 20 months. Holy moly! And tier 3 as well. That means a lot. I appreciate it. I'm gonna have to write down- Ev, I hope you're writing things down. <laughs> I'm gonna have to write down. <laughs> uh, of course I am, silly. Oh, I appreciate it. Thank you. It means a lot. Um, but I don't think I really mind losing a save file. Um, because it doesn't really matter. <laughs> um, it's not like I'm losing, you know, all the safe st stuff, you know what I mean? Like, I work so hard to get this. It's a story. Uh, 
It's not as long as the last trial, but they are longer in a sense, but it averages out to a slightly shorter than the first game. Okay, hell yeah! That that works for me. Hastily boost up my switch. <laughs> is it four cases or four extremely long cases? That is a question, huh? I've never played this game, but everyone else was coughing and I wanted to be cool. You're so cool, Colin. You're so cool. And I mean that. Ba, 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 ba. <sighs> uh, how did I get into this mess? We're gonna like try to actually do... Okay, voice acting. That's far enough! You can't run forever, Mr. Phoenix Wright. Oh, no. oh god, what is this production? What? What have I done wrong? I cannot allow you to go on like this. But I'm just a simple defense attorney. Silence! You are no longer worthy of your title. Get a smack with a gavel. Yeah, tour thinks I'm cool, eating nerds! <laughs> oh, it's a temporary! <gasps> it's almost my birthday! <laughs> Oh damn, with that jacket on and everything? What a nightmare. Oh god, look at that phone. I I was gonna say, I didn't even have a brick phone like that. Holy moly, what year is this? <laughs> and I bet it was his ringtone that caused it. I really shouldn't be dozing off right before a trial starts anyway. Huh? Looks like they hung up. Ah, oh, good. Oh, who the heck is this? Ah, oh, good. I finally found it. Talk about a close call. I hate to do this to you, but... Oh my gosh. Look at his hair streak. It's nothing personal, Mr. Attorney. What the heck is he gonna do to me? <laughs> a few minutes later, District Court, Defendant Lobby Number One. Nothing personal, kid. Ouch, my head. It's throbbing. And why does it feel so foggy in here? <gasps> it's Kazooie! <laughs> Wait! This is the lady that was in Gumshoe Locker, right? I don't remember. But is this the lady that was in Gumshoe's Locker? Yes? Who are you, and why are you important to Gumshoe? Good morning! <laughs> uh, good morning. What's wrong? You don't look well. People are at the best first thing in the morning. Where's that fighting spirit? Sorry, but can you please turn the cheeriness down? My head sort of hurts. Smacks your head. Mine does too! <laughs> Roger that! Um, am I in trouble or something? Huh? Trouble? Wait, never mind. You're a policewoman, right? Oh, I was thinking a flight attendant. She looks like me! <laughs> what? <laughs> Wait a second. <laughs> she doesn't have like the. the straps on the side and everything, but like. <laughs> Sil, so, welcome in! Thank you for the save! We actually just started! Broken glasses? What the? Found under the victim's body. Oh. We're in a case right now. Oh no. Thank you for the save! Whoa. It's red. Okay, so I can tell the difference between what's what then, I guess. Uh, Sil, how are you doing? How is, like, your full debut? How is it going? I thought maybe I had done something wrong? Uh, what are you talking about? I'm the one in trouble! What? I'm placing my life in your hands today, Mr. Phoenix Wright. Bird. Oh my god. <laughs> she is Kazooie. It's just Kazooie, as a person. I'm doing okay, it's still ongoing. It's a subathon, yeah! Please, please go check out Sue if you haven't already. 
like like we've said, uh, having a subathon, definitely go check out. They did being their new model. Also, Sinner. Hello. 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 Good. No. 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 Gow. Extra gow. I was supposed to do Alien Isolation, but I got distracted with Disney. Oh, my seven out. Wait, okay, there are a lot of Disney movies, though. Like, that's... That's fair. <laughs> <laughs> nah, you, you, you got it. I'm placing my life in your hands today, Mr. Phoenix Wright. Life? In my hands? You promised me. You said you would prove that I was not guilty. Not... Guilty? There's enough feathers for six flaps. <laughs> Look at her eyes. <laughs> it, uh, it was fun. We are all discussing Disney and hearing people's opinions. Yeah. What was your favorite? What was your top pick? What was your top Disney movie? Just when I thought all hope was lost. When all the other lawyers had laughed at me. Leave it to me, you said. You! The one and only Phoenix Wright came to save the day. And just like that, I was moved to tears, sir. I'll never forget what you're doing for me, ever. And Emperor's New Groove is the best one. Seems like a simple list to me. <laughs> uh, blink twice and uh, if you're under threat from a mouse. <laughs> Um, <laughs> uh, Amber's new group is good though. Goofy movie? Oh, the first one, right? I haven't seen the Goofy movie. I've seen extremely Goofy movie, but not um the first one. I need to. What is this girl babbling about? Actually, I really love to watch court proceedings, and I always root for you to win. When I'm off duty, I like to come here and. What's wrong? You've been acting really strange and you keep staring at me. The first one is goaded. I'll have to watch it. I think it's on the list for us all to watch uh, in my friend group. Uh, no, the first one is goofy. <laughs> I remember watching it, but I don't remember it, it at all. Hmm. Tora, would you like me to do a movie night with the first goofy movie? Uh, well, I don't, I don't mind. Made me kind of nervous, sir. Oh, sorry. Hmm. I'm afraid to ask, but here goes. So, this might sound bad, but, uh, who are you? What? Mr. Wright, how can you say that? How can you do this to the fragile heart of a girl about to go on trial? Uh huh. You're absolutely horrible. No, I mean, I didn't mean it like that. Is this how a defense attorney treats his client, sir? I can't believe this! Wait. I'm waiting. Second game. Hey, Dawson! Welcome in! Tora, would you like me to- Oh, I read that already. I don't know why I'm saying that, so, uh... Tora! <laughs> but I did read that already. <laughs> Your uniform's color match yours. I know, right? It's like me, but I'm not a cop. <laughs> it's not me. But it looks like me. I'm Kazooie now. I am the. Uh, maybe I'm the banjo. She's my Kazooie. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's just. Well, I think you have the wrong person. I'm. Yes? I'm. Is he gonna say he's not Phoenix? Who's Phoenix? I'm... Oh, no! I'm... Who am I? Why am I drawing a blank? Newcomer, welcome in! Look at that pat! BC is definitely not a cop, wink. I'm actually not, though. <laughs> I'm not associated with cops. The trial will begin shortly. Will the defendant and her lawyer please proceed to the courtroom immediately? She's the banjo to your Kazooie. Why, why is she the banjo? She's She has the feathers! She's the Kazooie! She's Kazooie. I want to be the banjo. 
Wait, if I look like this, am I the banjo? I look just like banjo, but I'm a tiger. It works, right? Always remember, ATC, ATAC, all Toras are cute. <laughs> <laughs> okay, fine. Okay, you're the banjo to her, Kazooie. I, I will accept this. <laughs> Tanjo. Bazooie. Bazooie. Torque, you. No. No. Tor is the cutest of all. Wah no. Tor is cute. No! <laughs> the trial's about to start. I'm counting on you in there, okay? Is Maya not back? No, Maya, where are you? I need you. Hmm, I guess I must have amnesia. Let's see. What can I piece together? From the sound of things, it's probably safe to say that I'm a defense attorney. And that girl... I said I'd pro prove her not guilty. I can't believe I made such an irresponsible promise. Ah, uh, someone please! Tell me this is just a bad dream! Why do I get the feeling this is one dream I won't be waking up from? This is all a dream. This is the theory. It's just all a dream. All of it. Never happened. September 8th, 10 a.m. District Court... 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 court, court District Court Court Group! <laughs> oh man. Is this the same guy from the first game? Oh, it's not music. Behold, the most contrived reason to justify the tutorial in a Days Attorney game. Amnesia. Hey, it works. I think it actually kind of works here a little, a little bit. Maybe not like completely because like, oh God, yeah, amnesia, the amnesia trope every single time, but I think it's kind of cool. It's interesting. I mean... I wonder how they gonna do the third game then. Big Apple, 3 a.m. <laughs> New York City Heights. Wait, what? Wait, what's the reference to the New York? Uh, good question, but have you seen the police? Wait, how the heck did the guy get away with bonking Nick in a freaking courthouse? It depends where he was in Phoenix in like a room, a lounge room, and that's why he was like kind of sleepy. And maybe no guards are in there, maybe? I think the amnesia trope can work in moderation. Yes, I agree. I agree. I think if it's done too much, it's too much, you know? I don't want it to be like, you know, too bad, but you know. Uh, TMNT games, you just sounded very similar to that in the TMT game. Oh! Oh! Hee hee. Hee hee. Court is now in session for the trial of Maggie Bird. The prosecution is ready, Your Honor. Who the fuck is this guy? I hate this guy. <laughs> Inner monologue. What is it, Mr. Wright? Um, uh, are you talking to me? Do you see any other defense attorneys here? I guess not. Oh, it's that prosecutor again. Yeah! The tutorial, man! <laughs> it's probably a prank, and they're all in it. Yeah, I even kick you. Yes, I'm ready. I guess I should say yes for now. Also, let me know if the music's too loud. It keeps, like, going up. I might turn it down a tiny bit. Right there. I was gonna say, it keeps like going up a little high, and then it kind of goes back to the down a low. Ah, oh, John Tutorial Man. Yes, John Tutorial. <laughs> I guess I should say yes for now. Are you ready, Mr. Wright? Yes, Your Honor. Wait a sec. If her life is in my hands, I should really do the responsible thing. Actually, you see, Your Honor, my memory is kind of... The court will not hear the defense's excuses. 
Because the defendant is a member of the police, this case is under great scrutiny. Therefore, we must make this trial fair but swift. I believe I have told you this before. I hope you're not telling me you've forgotten. Actually, I have. Poor Nick. Mr. Payne. Yeah, tell me. <laughs> your opening statement, please. Yes, Your Honor. As I'm sure you're all aware, the defendant is accused of killing her lover. What's worse, her lover was a fellow police officer. A policeman? You did what to a policeman? It wasn't me! Besides, Dustin and I... We weren't lovers like that. In any case, the prosecution will prove that the guilty party is none other than the defendant. Bring out the tutorial, witness. Mr. Guilty, oh my god. <laughs> I, I'm just the tutorial. That's the next level over there. I need to go to the next level right now. Very well. Mr. Payne, please call your first witness. <laughs> it's been a while, Mr. Wright. Who are you? <laughs> Let's see what you've learned since last time. I won't show you any mercy this time, rookie. Okay, and who are you again? I don't even remember who you are. Please leave me alone. The prosecution calls Detective Dick Gumshoe to the stand. Here we go. Don't let me down, Mr. Wright. Nowhere to hide. I'm so dead. We're gonna be fine. Witness! Please state your name and occupation. My, na my name is Dick Gumshoe, sir. But the I'm the detective in charge of homicides down at the precinct, sir. You don't look very well, detective. Well, sir, the defendant, she works under me. So, you know. You work under the detective? Yes, sir. And while I was a trainee, he was always watching out for me, sir. He's such a wonderful guy, sir. I'll never forget what he's done for me. Okay, calm down. I believe you. Detective Gumshoe, please describe for us the details of this murder. Yes, sir. It happened at the park near headquarters. Expose Park. The victim was one of the local cops, Dustin Prince. <laughs> I, I, I see, I see. Dustin Prince. Like, dusting for Prince? I... <laughs> That's a good one. I love these names so much. I, I, please keep them coming, game. I love... He was pushed down from the benches on the upper path, sir. The landing beat his body up bad, snapped his neck. Ooh! 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 It's so... No! The details are listed in the report that was disturbed yesterday. Disturbed? Distributed yesterday. Ah, oh, yes, the autopsy report, correct? Why do I not remember getting a copy? Probably weren't, honestly. Like, let's be honest, they don't give us anything. Oh, a new autopsy report? Pfft. Don't give that to Phoenix, he'll win. <laughs> now his name is Dustin Payne. Oh, Justin Payne. Oh! Got him! I see everything is in order here. Even the estimated time of death is unusually well documented. Unusually. The victim's watch stopped from the impact of the landing, sir. The results of the autopsy confirm the time of death. If I may, your honor. The prosecution would like to submit this photograph. Very well. The court accepts it into evidence. Right photo one under the court record. Now then, I recall at yesterday's preliminary pre preliminary pre 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 preliminary Oh my goodness, preliminary, preliminary, preliminary. If I say it enough times, I'm gonna get it right eventually, right? Gotta grab some caffeine, but you're Yeah yeah yeah. Go get your coffee. Uh now then if I recall at yesterday's preliminary hearing. A very important piece of evidence was brought to our attention. 
Yes, Your Honor. Yes, sir. Yes, I guess. Mr. Wright, is your head on right today? No, it's not. Preliminary. Preliminary. She sells seashells by... Oh, gosh, I already messed up. She sells seashells down by the seashore. See, down by the... Oh, I buy... I keep wanting to say buy down for some reason. No, my head's left. <laughs> She sells seashells down by the seashore. She sells seashells. She she sells seashells. She sells seashells by down by down down by down. <laughs> I'm gonna stop. While, uh, uh, I'm not ahead. <laughs> no, it's on Edgeworth. Oh, I see. <laughs> there was a very crucial piece of evidence found under the victim's body. Um, was there? Have you lost your mind? Well, actually, um, it's just nerves. Give me a second. What? How can you talk like such an amateur? I thought you were a pro, sir. Cinnamon, aluminium. Why did I say, oh my god, I've been hanging around Vern too much. Aluminium, aluminum, hot tin roof. Rural. I know some people who say hot tin roof. And I'm like, no, roof, roof, <laughs> roof, roof. Or, 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 or. Rubber baby buggy bumpers. Rubber baby buggy bumpers. <laughs> no! Rubber baby buggy bumpers. Rubber baby buggy buggy bugger. Bugger, bugger, bugger. Why can't I say tongue twisters? I wish I could. I, like, my mouth does not move fast enough for my brain. Rubber baby buggy bumpers. Rubber baby buggy bumpers. Rubber baby buggy bugger. Bumper. Damn it! All right, sir. I'll help you through this. At a time like this, maybe you want to take a glance at the court record. Court record? Yep. In in info about evidence and people involved with this case are all listed there, sir. You can look at the court record by pressing the R button. R button! R button! I'm an attorney? Oh my god. I found this in my pocket, but I don't remember what it means or how it got there. Can I look at it? No? Dustin! Uh, was he dating? Hmm. The R button, huh? What the fuck is the R button? Bros lag! Thank you for subscribing. No! No! Vintage Toroglyphs. <laughs> Bros like, thank you for the tier one for five months. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. Thank you for the lurk call on as well. Thank you. Uh, bus time's over. See you on 30. Hell yeah. Get home safe. I can't believe you pulled that clip out of nowhere on me. That was so fast. Rubber baby buggy bumpers. Rubber baby buggy bumpers. Rubber baby buggy bumpers. Uh, I, that's good enough for me. <laughs> The R button, huh? You really know what you're talking about, don't you? It's too bad I'm a cop, right? Just think, I could totally be a legal aide instead. Mr. Wright. Yes, Your Honor. Court is in session. Save your chit-chat for later. Sorry, Your Honor. Man, he's being really hard on Phoenix right now. Well, I guess I'd better check the court record and see what I can find. What was it again? The R button? All right, Mr. Wright, let's see if your notes are in order. What was the piece of evidence found underneath the victim's body? He wins! Wow, it's Toa! Kim, welcome in! Also, Thrush, welcome in! Hope you guys are having a really good weekend. Hope you guys are having a good day so far today. We got glasses. Found under the victim's body. Pieces of nearsighted lenses were found nearby. Or is it nearsighted glasses? Or is it... Farsighted. Like, is it different glasses shards? I know it only shows, like, a little bit of shards out from the glasses, but I feel like I need to know. <gasps> Googlies! Thank you. Uh, to be fair, he sat through an entire game of his shenanigans. Okay, to okay, fair, fair, fair. <laughs> um, bu 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 near sighted, as in almost sighted? Got him! I got him! Okay, uh, what was underneath the victim's body? 
A wallet, the police badge, glasses. Glasses. That's simple, Your Honor. A broken pair of glasses. That's right. The victim grabbed his killer's glasses as he was being shoved, sir. And held on to them as he fell. Wait. Say that again? Can I read that again? Wait, so this was the per the killer. He grabbed the killer's glasses and took it with him? Oh, <gasps> you want to, you would be funny. If the guy that hurt her head, I mean, he could be the murderer, of course. But what if he it was his glasses, he did the murdering. Didn't What if he didn't mean hit Phoenix, but he just saw an attorney and was like, "Yeah, I'm going to hit her on the head." Um, I don't know. <laughs> can't see a thing without my glasses. Same. <laughs> okay, wow, I didn't even notice the googly eyes until I looked to the screen again. Google, 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 Googles, Googles. Also, I got, um, BeekuBot, uh, downloaded the other day. Um, and I want to get that sorted out, but then I, uh, <laughs> it's not working. <laughs> oh, and, um... I'm gonna try later today, though. I think I might have been downloading, like, the wrong thing or something. I'm a little technologically inclined, I think. Crabs! Welcome in! How are you doing? Achoo, no? Mm -hmm. <laughs> hey! What are you giving me the evil eye? Or why- wait. Why are you giving me the evil eye? Those glasses you're wearing. Mm-hmm. Yes, this is my spare pair. Oh, don't tell them that. Don't tell them that. How is you? I'm doing good. I had a really stressful weekend. Um, I feel like a lot of my weekends have been really stressful. It's like no rest, only stress. <laughs> uh, but, but like besides that, I'm doing okay. I'm finally able to place attorney and I'm really excited. Did you bring enough caffeine for the whole class? Yeah, I am. Did you bring enough? I don't like coffee though, so you got to have another substitute. I hope you know. Also, let me get some water really quick. Oh. Eat him till you sent by a throne.com. I'm sorry, but I saw the bimberly and I'm like, I laughed a little. <laughs> Aw. A bimberly wink. Wink. <laughs> Thank you. My god, little Pochita! That's appreciated, thank you. Wah. Wah. Thank you. Eat! I don't want to eat Pochita! Eat him! No! He's gonna be a little hard though. He's a, he's a figure, so I don't know. <laughs> Wait, how can I eat him? Do I need to melt him? Eat him. <gasps> Inserts him into my heart. <laughs> Is that good enough? I just shove him straight into my chest. It's, it's like him for real. Is tap water okay? Bring the table some water. No. I want I want the fanciest water. I want spring water. I want straight from the waterfall. I want that fish piss. Pff, go hydrate. Okay. <laughs> I've got to hydrate again. <laughs> I'm actually like really hot right now. Um, so... I'm gonna drink as much water as I can. Huh? Fish piss, yeah. Spring water, fish piss. Fish, fish, fish. Fish piss. Uh, yes, this is my spare pair. But these glasses they found at the scene of the crime are not mine, I swear, sir. You sure about that? Look. It was a coincidence that on the same day I actually stepped on mine. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yeah? Okay. I'm really hot right now. Gay! <laughs> Flips there. <laughs> Tucks hair behind ear. <laughs> a coincidence... A, what? A coincidence? What was I going to say? I don't know. A coincidence, she says? <laughs> Your honor. I have further evidence to present. Oh, you have more? And this evidence is very decisive. A coinky dink. A coinky dink. Very well. Let's hear from our witness about this evidence. 
ADHD tigers having problems. Did I was I in the middle of a sentence? <laughs> okay, like guys, let me be honest. I my ADHD has been off the charts. Like really bad. That's kind of why my weekend was a little stressful. Um because I literally would be in the middle of doing one thing and then totally get distracted. Forget I'm doing something. I literally open a tab to open up a new site or something and then I forgot. It's been really bad, and I don't know what's going on, and it's actually becoming a problem. <laughs> Thank you for the hydrate, the posture check, and the stretch, Rodin. I appreciate it. All day, heavily distracted, all the time, every single day. Literally, if I ever stop talking in the middle of a sentence, please say something, because I want to make sure I finish my sentences. <laughs> But I'm like, I, I sometimes I just don't remember I if I left a discussion. And now I'm wondering if I need to be tested for ADHD, because I know I have it. I, it's just a matter of getting diagnosed. Um. <laughs> and that, that, that would just be more problems than it's worth. It's so expensive. This music, though, is really nice. I'm glad they have new music in this game. I, I didn't expect it at all, but I'm... I'm here for it. Thank you for the head pad! I appreciate it! Maybe you want to take a look at that? Because it sounds like it's getting out of control. Mm-hmm! Mm-hmm! There's something even more incriminating than the glasses under the victim's body, sir. During his date, the victim was pushed from the bench area. But he managed to write the culprit's name on the ground where he landed. Of course he did! No. Well, I'm. His neck snapped. You cannot be serious right now. His neck snapped. You are not alive. You're dead. You. You. <laughs> Maybe he was running out of true love. That's the most fanciest handwriting. Also, while you're dying, <laughs> Maggie Simpson is the unaliver. <laughs> oh. I don't like saying it, but it was clearly the defendant's name, Maggie, sir. Maybe it was... Maybe it was a different name that started with Maggie. Uh, Ace Attorney 2 has some of my favorite tracks in the series. They just set the mood so well. Ooh, I'm excited. That's the fanciest routing I've ever seen in Unalive. Alive. Yes, exactly. That's what I'm saying. With this piece of evidence in the glasses, it's hard not to say she's the culprit. I mean, it is kind of hard to say that. This is a picture of the writing, Your Honor. I... Why, this is... Yes, I can see her name is clearly written here. Yeah, clearly, that's the problem. Dies in cursive. <laughs> is it Leon? <laughs> Did he write? Oh my god, yeah! Also, hey, yeah, welcome in. He wrote Leon. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> I'm like realizing <laughs> what happened. Uh huh. And then welcome in. Uh, um. Mm, 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 mm. Ooh, murmur. Arr, arr, arr. Okay. The prosecution would like to submit this picture. Understood. The court accepts it into evidence. Hey, Nata, I see you're a first-time chatter. And, uh... You would like the Discord. I hope, uh... I hope you enjoy your stay. As if the glasses alone didn't make you look suspicious. The victim even wrote your name clear as day on the ground. But, 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 I already told you. Those glasses aren't mine. And how do you explain this dying message? It's a conspiracy. I'm not guilty, sir. It's a conspiracy. Conspiracy. Mr. Wright, you say cross exa You may cross-examine the witness. Cross-examine? This is it. I'm counting on you. Sure, but what am I supposed to do? What? This isn't like you at all. 
Normally, this is the part where you get in the witnesses' faces. Get in their faces and do what? I guess there's no way around it. Okay, I'm gonna lend you a hand. The prosecution's witnesses all hide things from the court. How you doing, Gav? I hope you haven't had a good weekend. Which means they lie from time to time. Lie? But isn't that the detective of your superior? Well, even if they don't mean to lie, sometimes people just remember things wrong. Hmm. Like the detective. He does sort of look like he is scatterbrain. Okay, but Gumshoe is a good guy. It doesn't matter. Either way, it's bad for us, sir. Just like me for real. That's why when you question witnesses, you have to find and expose their lies. Doing really well, just working on a contract signing at the moment. <gasps> hey yo? Hey yo? Congrats? Phoenix, it's time to start throwing punches. It's no longer a course case game. It's now punch out. Man, I'd love to see that. Oh, I mean, technically, um... What's the game called? The fighting game. Capcom versus Marvel. Um, and Phoenix writes in the game, I think, right? He starts objections at people. I feel better when I'm actually signed and working. Let's go! Yeah, I'm kind of happy for you, Gav. I'm glad. Mr. Wright, your cross-examination, please. I feel like a lot of people right now are, uh... Things are turning up for them, and I'm like, really... I'm really proud of you guys. I'm really glad. Yes, Your Honor. Talk about trial by fire. Er, talk about trial by fire. Here goes nothing. As long as I can expose the lies, we should be all right. Cross examination. Hmm. This is very like somber. And I, I think I like the first game, like, the more, like, dun, 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 you know what I mean? Unless that's, it's just gonna change or anything like that. Um, I am beyond myself that you forgot that, uh, it was Marvel vs. Capcom. I have never played Marvel vs. Capcom. I'm actually surprised I remember it as much as I have. The only reason why I do know about it is because, um, uh, because Amaterasu's in it. <laughs> And I'm... I was like, oh, what? Because that's what the only game I knew in that game at the time. I want to get Marvel vs. Capcom 3. I really want to get it. I, I don't know. It's just, just a goofy game. I think it's funny. People having jobs is good. You know that you can do with the money. Get a tier 3 sub. <laughs> hey guys, you can get a tier 3 sub and I will draw you. I didn't mean to do that. I just put my controller against my chest and it pressed the button for me. I think I just pushed the, uh... Wait, I can push right now? That's interesting. Uh, play fighting games. Play Guilty Gear. Let yourself, uh, be corrupted. There's hot women in the game. Okay, you've sold me. It's a hilarious game. Oh, you're making me want it more now. It was on sale last month. What? It was? Oh. Is it on PC? Hmm. Jill? <gasps> Jill? Jill is in the game! Let's see, we got Phoenix, we got Amaterasu, we got Jill. Th th that is enough for me. I will give to me. <laughs> th thank you. <laughs> thank you for throwing women at me. <laughs> I feel like every time I say that, it makes me laugh. Man, okay, now I really want it. Um, about those glasses. Do you have any proof that those belong to my client? Are there- are they her prescription? Hmm? The lenses are for nearsightedness and are almost the same strength as hers. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Even the frames look kind of like the one she's wearing in her ID, pal. Oh, I gotta let Misty down one second. There we go. If you Google Guilty Gear Strive, you'll see some cute girls. <sighs> I need to play Guilty Gear. 
man. So true, Kim. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, you're making me add games to the list. I can't afford. I can't afford it. I want it all. Tora, you should play Guilty Gear with me. If I could afford it, I totally would. Because I honestly miss fighting games a little bit. I need to play more Smash Brothers, at least. Like, that's enough of a fighting game for me. But I need to actually... I want to learn how to do an actual fighting game. And, like, be good at it. Like, one of the side... ...ones. Almost Christmas means it wasn't. <laughs> that's what Throne is for! You have a Throne! Also, exclamation point Throne, if you would like to gift anything... <laughs> It's is there. Even the frames look kind of like the one she's wearing in her ID, pal. I haven't smashed in so long. Me too. Last time I played was like months ago with Verm. And we gained and dwarfed each other. <laughs> <laughs> we burger being bubettist. <laughs> uh, continue pressing. Might as well. Hold it. Almost and kind are not good enough in a case like this. Almost is not Christmas. Tekken and GG are girls are intentionally making my gayness worse. Dude. Same. <laughs> this is how I feel with like Tomb Raider and Resident Evil. And very I think I think when I played Resident Evil 3, that's when I think I was like more open to being like a little sepic on stream a little bit, because I was like, chill! <laughs> And then unapologetically. <laughs> Worse or better? Okay, that's a good question, actually. <laughs> it's making me... Think about Jill. <laughs> Almost and kind of are not good enough in a case like this. Jill's insane. Dude, when she was in... Because I, I got Jill in Fortnite, right? I love her in Fortnite so much. Her model's so good. It's so fun. <laughs> Mommy? <laughs> if you are more gay, then it's better. If you're less gay, then it's worse. You gotta be. You gotta, you gotta be. You don't make the rules. I think. <laughs> you think? <laughs> Guilty Gear is also where the Jacko pose tent. Oh, that's Guilty Gear. Okay. Okay, okay. I did not draw myself in the Jacko pose. I was like... I would not be that flexible, there's no way! <laughs> nope, no way! <laughs> but if you don't have a side... Hey! Being, uh... Honestly, being whatever you like is... As long as you're very much open to... You know, yourself and your feelings, that is excellent. Um... Whether that be... Ace, or... You know, you have an attraction, or... Uh, non-romantic or anything, anybody, a-okay. As long as you are yourself. I mean, I know two people who were talking about a few streams back, maybe a VTuber comp competition. Ooh. Ooh, do we have a training arc like we did with Pokken Tournament? <laughs> we just had a training arc with Pokken. And people said I did okay with that, too, so... I mean, maybe with enough practice, I can, uh... Be good at a fighting game. Uh, um... Do you have more definitive... Uh, do you have more definitive proof? I'm back with, like, the... You're, everyone, everyone is accepted. Everyone is valid here. I wanna... I know I probably don't need to say that, but I also wanna make that very, very, very clear. Um, that... No matter what you are, you, you're just accepted. No matter what. Uh, I might take one gender and sexuality and ace pan gender fluid because you never know, man. <laughs> never know. Never know. Never know. I, I'm gonna DM you a bunch of Guilty Gear ladies, please. Please. <laughs> please. <laughs> oh, I, I need it. Is there something that clearly links the defendant with those glasses? Uh, um, um, uh... The dirt and sand rubbed down any traces of fingerprints or anything else. How'd that happen? So, what you're saying, detective... 
is that you have nothing that proves those glasses are my clients. If you know how to find it, there could be a tiger at a certain Pokémon tournament. Yar. I'm gonna sleep. Bit, uh, been awake since 3 a.m. today. I just have to say, I saw you awake really early today, Rodan. Uh, I hope you have a, a lovely rest of your stream, Rodan. I hope you have an amazing sleep. I hope you have a good tomorrow, and I will see you again soon. Chotora Abba, ABA, ABA. I think it's going to be Geo. Hmm. Is everyone gonna predict who my favorite character is? Is this what's gonna happen? And then we're gonna do a bet. <laughs> Mist, welcome in. Good to see you. Hello. Hope you're having a good day. Hope you had a good weekend. Uh, something like that. What? I see. Hmm. So there is no proof. Wow, that was amazing. Well, they just turned their minds around immediately. Observe DMs for wow, man. Okay, let me go look. Let me let me see if people are correct on my taste in characters. Oh my god. <laughs> Hold on, I'm scrolling. Hmm. Who's the first lady? <laughs> wait, but the... Wait, wait, okay, there's two. I like two. They're all really nice, but... The one with the... The samurai sword? And then the second one with the wolf. Both of them. I feel like the wolf one, if people guess the wolf one, uh, you guys guessed it because it's a wolf one. <laughs> oh good, uh, bike it, my beloved. The one with the wolf is... Uh, Giovanna? Gio was right, baby! It's cool! I was gonna say, I think the wolf is cool. Is it, I'm assuming it's like a... Oh, it's so cute though, I wanna, I wanna touch it. I wanna- I wanna pet the wolf, man! I like wolves a lot! Oh, that was amazing! I could totally feel it, down in my gut! During his date, the victim was pushed from the bench area. Let's just push everything. That's so weird that we have the ability to push. Uh, when we didn't have that ability in the first trial last game. Now you're sure she- he was pushed, and that's how he fell. Yeah, pal, if you look at the wounds in the victim's body, there's no way it was anything else. Uh, Biken is way better than Geo. God, I let Biken push. <laughs> there's no way it was anything else. Why'd I say that? <laughs> she does things to the people, I guess. <laughs> but I've convinced you to gear. Possibly. Or forget the true, pretty sleeping, guilty gear, soul, bad guy. Is that supposed to be like a Ace Attorney reference? Hi, Miss Steve. You want back up here? Hold on a second. Let me grab the cat. There we go. My favorite is outfit, partially because I absolutely thought it was a fan club sign up sheet. Wait, who is that? I'll have to see a picture. Soul's quite pretty. Wait, that's a real person? <laughs> you understand later? Okay. <laughs> hmm. Please continue with your testimony, detective. Anyway, the victim fell pretty far. Google eyes, oh my lord, it's your Googles! Came back to sillies. A silly. We're being sillies. We're being kinda. We're talking about Guilty Gear. <laughs> and talking about the characters. We're being really big silly. Freddy Fazbear. But he managed to write the culprit's name on the ground where he landed. How did he do that? He's neck broken. He's broken. The culprit's name. 
usual thing when it takes a turn, really. Yes, we get very distracted by conversations. I enjoy it, though. I like it. I don't know how you guys feel about it, but I like it. <laughs> yeah, I was surprised, too. <laughs> I didn't want to believe it, but... Was the name that of my client? I don't like saying it, but it was clearly the defendant's name, Maggie, sir. Are you absolutely certain? Sorry, pal, but that's what it said. This is a picture of it. No matter which way you look, it still says Maggie. Well, turn it upside down. Maybe it looks like something else. Hold on. Uh, check. Ooh. 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 Nothing upside down would look like that, though. <laughs> hmm, he's got a point. Hey, hold on! Huh? Don't hum me! I know the picture says Maggie, but... Now that you mention it, something does feel kind of off about this picture. That's how you know you found a contradiction! Now hurry up and present some evidence! So that's what spotting a contradiction feels like. I'd better check the court record again. With this piece of evidence in the glasses, it's hard not to say she's not the culprit. I'm assuming they're making me having to do this right now, right here. No? Why would you say something? Why would you say something? Yeah, yeah, blah, blah. Maybe he tried spelling magic, but neck broken, so he forgot. <laughs> Head empty, full of Maggie. <laughs> uh. There was a game, there's a fighting game. I think it was Skullgirls that like Vern was playing a lot. And I was watching the him play. That one is very cool. When it comes to, like, the animations and stuff like that. It's very... It's very... Jiggly. <laughs> Mr. Wright, please think the facts over before making accusations. I don't think that won any points to the judge. No. Showgirls has some cute girls, too. Dude, I like the guy. Like, the one guy. I think he's funny. <laughs> He's a himbo. <laughs> and you are certain that it was the victim who wrote the name on the ground. Chico Epa. Exactly. There were scratches on his fingers from the rough sand. And there were grains of sand under his pointer finger now. Hmm. It certainly seems that the name was written by the victim himself. That didn't go well. If the writer really was the victim himself, then we're in a lot of trouble. Don't give up. Keep that fighting spirit going. I'm glad you're all pumped up, but I really want to see your special move, sir. By my what? You always look so cool when you present evidence. Present evidence? Oh, that present evidence. GG's uh, equal opportunity horn in my man. Got his titty and ab on full display as he should. Oh, wait, who's your main crab? Who's your, who's your main? Valentine from Skullgirls. Which one's that again? I don't know their names exactly. If you just like remind me, I can probably remember. Why would you throw something? Why are you, why? Oh, thank you for the love. <laughs> why are you throwing things at me? Oh, you- oh, he's like a big guy with a fan. Well, he has glasses, too. I didn't even see him at first. He hits you with fan. He's an airbender. He breathes and he goes from double D to A. A. <laughs> what is it? J- to a Jacob, I understand. That's insane. I throw love because I love you. Oh. Okay, I forgive you. I forgive the throw. Male wife stripper. <laughs> stripper? Oh. Ah. Thank you, senior. I love you, by the way. Bye. 
Actually, I was just thinking about that. Yes, the Great Phoenix Ride is back! Oh, that's right. Huh? I heard that lately you can present not only evidence, but people's profiles as well. <gasps> Booby. <laughs> wow. Angie and Bacon are a wife and husband. Yeah. Angie is the wife, Bacon is the husband. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 100% <laughs> factual. I, I can believe. I can believe. The way the walk cycle was, yes, I can believe all of that. I hear that lately you can present not only evidence, but people's profiles as well. It sure makes things a bit more complicated, so be careful, sir. People's profiles... Is this new? I don't remember being able to present profiles. Maybe like one time in the first game, but not... I don't remember. Alright, let's give this another try. Maybe it's his glasses. You ever thought of that? Why are you going to me? Um... Who would I even present? We don't have anybody really to give. I want to manage to write the culprit's name on the ground where he landed. I want to give the autopsy. Broken neck. That's presented. No? This is for all? Even for me? Of course! Also, welcome in, Hexen. Hope you're having a good day. My client is innocent because... Present Edgeworth's profile. Husband says so! Vala, welcome in! Hope you're having a good day as well. Like, it is, like, beyond hot. I, I, I can confirm. I've only seen her one time, and I can agree. I don't understand how this is not contradictory. What do you mean? Oh. Am I in the right direction, but like wrong thing again? I seem to do that a lot. Managed to write the culprit's name on the ground where he landed. Did I click this one, right? I don't say anything, but it was clearly the defendant's name, Maggie. Um. Didn't they tell you that you could present profiles? But, like, who do I present, though? <gasps> oh! 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 I understand the spelling! I didn't even see that! Oh my god! <laughs> Dang. I just... Mm. I understand. Oopsie. I understand now. Thank you for the lurk, Crabs! Have a good day at work! <laughs> what is it? Did I get my memories back? What? What's come over me? Without thinking, I just blurted out objection. And I yelled at the top of my lungs, finger outstretched and ready to take on my opponent. Oh, music. What a rush. Detective Gumshoe. You're, you're talking to me, pal? Please state the defendant's name for me. Objection! I forgot he sounded <laughs> like that. What are you trying to prove with the futile exercise, Mr. Wright? You'll see. This is a very crucial line of questioning. Actually, Mr. Payne, you can answer. The defendant's name, if you please. Where is this ridiculous question coming from? Lemon grab moment. Unacceptable conditions! That is like the loudest I'm gonna scream ever. <laughs> Not straight. <laughs> the defendant's uh, name is uh, Maggie Bird. How do you know how you're spelling it? Can I read his text? And that's how I know how he's spelling it? I think someone needs to check the core record. What? And it says right here that's Maggie Bird. Ah! It looks like Bird caught the cat napping. Oh my, you got, you sure did get him. Unacceptable! 
<laughs> you can knock that memory out of the attorney, but you can't knock the attorney out of the attorney. <laughs> you can't knock the attorney out of the memory. Uh, I too speak in subtitle. <laughs> oh, oh my god. Everyone has subtitles in this world. Everyone can just read. Everyone has a bar in front of them every, at all times. What's going on here? I have no idea either, sir. As you could see, the victim did indeed leave a name Maggie. However, the defendant's name was actually spelled Maggie. <gasps> Maggie, oh yes, I too have words appear in front of me when I speak. <gasps> me too? <gasps> Guys, if you turn on the closed captions, I think there's closed captions at all times on Twitch, right? Um, but yeah, if you, I think uh, if you turn the closed captions off. I also have subtitles. Hello! Can't knock the phoenix out of the subtitles. <laughs> this is a blatant contradiction of facts. Oh, how about that? I hadn't even noticed. Objection! Not in my view, I think. Oh. Uh... But, but, but maybe the victim didn't know how to spell her name correctly. Objection. May I remind you that it was you who said the defendant is accused of killing her lover? Every time I hear the brrrr, I think there's an alert happening on OBS. Like, you guys did something and I hear brrrr, you know? Even though I have no alerts that sound like that, but I keep thinking about the... If they were truly lovers, it would be impossible for him to have not known her name. I mean, maybe it's not a spell. No! No! <laughs> Considering Jalaporn- Well, Japanifornia canonically has hologram tech in the courtrooms. Live subtitles aren't even all that Im improbable. Mm -hmm. I'm not seeing closed captions as an option. No! Maybe I need to, like, turn them on or something. I also can't spell. <gasps> they were like Kate. How do you think musical? Or what do you think musical? <laughs> oh, maybe I have to look into um, closed captions and seeing if I can turn them on or something. This is very true. Mr. Payne. Yes, Your Honor. Are you absolutely certain that the defendant and the victim, Dust and Prince, were in fact lovers? Here in California. <laughs> That's the best banarfness. <laughs> You're so right. Banarfnia. Oh, God speaking! I don't know why that reminded me, but I had my uh, first Pathfinder game um, on Friday last week. And it was a lot of fun. I'm playing a, a big tiger. Nice clap. There we go. Big clap. <laughs> Gotta cup the hands. Um, but I had my first Pathfinder game, and my character is a big tiger barbarian. And I, the most, you know, because I was playing, because um, the king's character, like, goes over, and I want, I want these bones from this rat! And I'm like, okay, okay. Um, you, helped, you healed me, and you got, like, a uh, nat 20 on your healing, and you healed me exponentially. I'm going to help you with this rat. So I pick up the rat, and I, I also roll extremely high, and I literally debone the rat with my bare hands. Like, 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 like a banana. <laughs> like, I literally go, and just de-skin the rat. Uh, <laughs> de-muscle, de-everything. I deboned the rat, and I gave King's character the bones. It was great. <laughs> That's the most memorable thing I could come up, like, that happened during that entire session. <laughs> I hope you had fun. It was good. It's my first time playing Pathfinder. It's like my third time doing anything TTRPG. So I was like, <gasps> I'm scared. I'm nervous. But I got to play a tiger guy. So I'm like really excited and happy about it. Squish the rat. <laughs> God extreme. Are you playing Pathfinder 4.6? I don't know what Pathfinder it is exactly. Um... But it is a Pathfinder, yes. <laughs> I don't know very well, um... TTRPG thingies, but I'm learning. It's called the... the gloving, but it was on a live, it's called skinning. It was... it was dead, yes, it was a dead rat. I... I... this is also like a rat that I've literally cleaved in half, because I also rolled extremely high. 
Uh, <laughs> I'm, um, I'm barbarian, am I right, fellas? <laughs> I literally my character at this point is just the go get him, go get him, sick him, and then like yo guys, I got him. And this is just a himbo. <laughs> yes, I am quite certain, Your Honor. Versions are crazy. Oh. Uh, your third time and they put you on Pathfinder? That's mean. No, 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 no. It's fine, it's fine. Verm has been, like, really good about it. Verm helps me make my character and everything like that, too. Um. I'm trying to think, like, what the first one was. It was, like, an alien uh, TTRPG. And then it was... The second one was, like, a... Shit, what was the other one? I'm not... <laughs> I don't remember. But I had, like, a werewolf kind of girl that I like a lot. And I drew actually drew her in the Discord. I posted her in my art section. Um, if you missed that. Um, I should also post my guy. Uh, my, my tiger guy um, in the Discord eventually. Soon. So when I make more drawings of him, I, I, I want to post more about him. I trust in Verm to not do anything too crazy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Verm's been really good. If anyone doesn't know, Verm is the DM. <laughs> or GM? GM. <laughs> Who wants to mess with Karlak? I have not played, um... Bor uh, Baldur's Gate, but Karlak? Yes. 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 Her design's really good. Yes. 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 Also, please go check out Verm. If you have not already, Verm is a really good dude. Karlak is wife. 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 Karlak is wife. I love her so much. I know nothing about her. But I know I love her. <laughs> they were a well-known couple in the police force. Detective Gumshoe. Please testify for the court. The relationship between the victim and the defendant. Yes, sir. Karlak is wife. Karlak is wife. The uh, first could have been the actual alien RPG, or maybe Mothership? Mothership sounds familiar, but I, I also don't want to... I don't want to assume either. Karlak is very good, yes. <laughs> D and GM are both acceptable. Some people don't like being referred to as Dungeon Master. It makes them feel awkward. Oh. But Game Master's okay? Oh, is it because it's like, uh... Do people have, like, um... Not safe for work? Uh... <laughs> Like things with that name? Or am I making this up? <laughs> is that why they're uncomfortable? It's more that DM is specific Dungeons and Dragons. Oh, true, true, true. DM is the D&D term. GM is a general term. Gotcha. Okay, I'm just making things up then about the... <laughs> Dungeon Master. Uh, <laughs> Demon Will is a good boy too. I feel like I, I, I've seen them. Their name sounds very familiar. Because I played a little bit of Baldur's Gate, but then didn't get too far in it. One is copyrighted, the other isn't. Oh, okay. DM is also very specific for D&D. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, I'm, I'm learning! Tora's mind went there th this time. Okay, okay. To be fair, Korgoth said that it makes them feel awkward. And I'm like, why would that make them feel awkward? That's weird. Why, but, would that be like a... <laughs> for a uh, unsay-so reason? <laughs> Oh. What was that? Oh, oh. Did you hear that? <laughs> Did you hear something in my room just go snap? Oh my gosh, what the heck was that? <laughs> my room is falling apart. I don't know, I definitely have a connotation around the word dungeon master. <laughs> See? Goblin, welcome in. How are you doing? I hope you're doing well. Um, GM is more uh, open ended. And it can be used with any TTRP RPG. Gotcha, gotcha. Unsay so reasons, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, <laughs> Asterion is actually good as a character. Mm -hmm. I've seen him. He's probably the one I've seen the most on like Twitter and stuff. Officer Prince and Officer Bird had been going out for about a half a year. Why did she say they weren't dating? It sounded like they were even talking about marriage. Why would she say they weren't dating? The day of the incident just happened to be the victim's birthday, sir. Maggie, I mean Officer Bird, had gotten Officer Prince a present. It was something she had bought over two months ago. I should know, because she came to me, what, ask what she 
Wait, let me read it. Uh, I should know, because... Because <laughs> she came to me to ask what she should get for him. Uh, bro, I'm just letting him see no matter what you do. Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. Oh, Sarian? Yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, I'm just saying, when I called myself a DM, it did get asked on say-so version. See, I'm not the one! See, Gorgoth meant it that way! I'm not crazy! <laughs> oh, those two sound like they were close. No, never. <laughs> Nevertheless, tragedy struck. Hmm, yes, I see. You may cross-examine the witness, Mr. Wright. Yeah, you all good, Kim. I'm gonna buy some pasta for Alfredo. I kind of want Alfredo. <gasps> Can you make some for me too? Alfredo sounds so good right now. I'll gladly put the blame on Korgoth this time then. <laughs> <laughs> um, That's why I am a... Spieletter? Spieletter? No one say so connotations here at all. Nothing at all. Nothing at all. <laughs> Officer Prince and Officer Bird had been going out for about half a year. Press it. How do you know about this? Every year in March, we have a training camp for us cops. Officer Bird was a rookie at the time, and she and Officer Prince seemed to hit it off. Mmm, Alfredo. Ooh. Man, that makes me hungry. You got close, I take it. Actually, I was supposed to go too, but I couldn't pay the deposit for the trip, so I didn't. If only I'd gone on that trip. What is it? Oh, uh, nothing, sir. Really. Anyway. Okay, that sauce is heck. It sounded like they were even talking about marriage. Dude, you're being so saucy! Uh... Marriage? But wasn't the victim eight years older than her? Salary cut too many times. Dang, god dang it, Edgeworth. What? You saying a guy's gotta marry someone the same age as himself, pal? No, that's not what I meant at all. I think that Gumshoe and Dustin were only a year apart, you know. Excuse me? Is Gumshoe like 31? Hold on. What the? I always thought he was like 35 or something, you know? I mean, close, but... I didn't even think about it. I think the gumshoe and Dustin were only a year apart, you know? Ugh, I think this fella has ways to go before marriage. Mind your own business, pal! What the hell? I thought he was 40. <laughs> Fuck, I feel old. <laughs> he definitely looks older than 31, I guess. Well, it's like, I think... Phoenix also looks older than... Damn it, there's no picture here. How old he is? I don't know how much, like, time skip has happened since the first game. If any. But, um... I'm assuming he's, like, 26 right now, right? Gumshoe looks like 42 and a dead wife. No! He's a tragic backstory. Nah, look, I'm in. Where's Edgy? Unfortunately, Edgy's on vacation. <laughs> I don't know where he is. Just a year? Oh, oh, wow! Oh, wow, 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 wow. It's been, like, a while. I didn't think it had been a, been a... Oh, why can't I talk right now? I didn't think it'd be a whole year. The day of the incident just happened to be the victim's birthday, sir. The day of the incident? You mean September 6th? Yeah. The victim, Officer Prince, had just gotten on duty at 5.30 p.m. that day. And since Maggie's night shift hadn't started yet, they went to the park for a bit. I remember when I was young and in love. Oh, it was a jolly time. That's great, Your Honor. I'm glad you're such a cheerful old man. <laughs> I'm 31. This can't be happening. <laughs> Kim <laughs> Gumshoe. Maggie, I mean Officer Bird, had gotten Officer Prince a present. What was the present? Anya. 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 Uh, Edward went to go buy milk. <laughs> he would be back any minute now. Any minute. This game is set in the far future of 2017. Wow. When did this game come out? Like, originally? You seem to know a lot about the defendant. 
Well, that's because uh, I'm her boss and I've got to watch out for my subordinates. Uh-huh. Is she like your niece or something, Mr. Gumshoe? Why do you have her picture in your locker? That's so strange of you. And now you're calling her Maggie? And not Officer Bird? Sus. But even what she was going to give as a- wait. But even what she- what? <laughs> but even what she was giving- or, Why can't I freaking say that this? <laughs> but even what she was going to give as a present. Isn't that going a bit too far? Hey, pal, watch what you say. I know everything that happens under me. If someone so much as scratches their... I really don't need to know that much. I need to know! <laughs> I want to know what they're scratching! That's terrifying, Ab. That is actually freaking scary. It doesn't pop up on stream, but it's like a black and white version of the peak emote. The fucking objection. <laughs> 1999 it was 18 billion years ago. No! Crazy 2017 was seven years ago. I don't see it either. I thought it wouldn't work. Or I thought it didn't work. It's freaky! Mr. Wright, please refrain from badgering the witness. I agree. Even if this witness has a crush on the defendant, that should not be the point of discussion at this time. Whoa, wait a second. Why are we talking about this? It's all your fault, pal. You're guilty. Guilty, guilty. I should have you arrested. Or maybe they're exes or something. I think the good detective is about done here. Uh, I'll turn the witness into a badger if I want. Badger, badger. <gasps> Ev, I hate that. 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 <laughs> Now it's a black and white version of, uh... Of, uh, what did I call that? I don't even remember what the emote's called, I'm not gonna lie! I can't see it! Well, you can't see it in chat either? Like, Twitch chat? Strange. Uh, murders a witness, your honor! Case resolved! <gasps> no! Hold it. Hold it! Over two months ago! Yep, she's a very considerate woman, pal. How would you know that? So, what was this birthday present? She got him a glove. Just one glove? A single glove? Why would she only give him one? Um, actually... Um, actually, your honor, this glove in question is a baseball glove. Oh, I see. A baseball glove. Officer Prince is a huge baseball fan. A baseball glove, hmm? Press further. Just now, I believe you said that the present was something she had bought over two months ago. Yeah. Are you saying she bought the glove at the store that far in advance? No, nothing like that, pal. Then what is it like? She ordered it. It was custom made. Actually, actually, I need a glove for judge. For the for, uh, murders to judge, your honor. I'm just better at law. Easy. I need a glove for each hand when I base the balls. <laughs> base. Base the balls. I don't know about my joke now. Yeah, no, you're sticking with it. It's your joke. You have to stick with it. I like it. Base the balls. <laughs> custom made. The glove was custom made? Yep, that's what I said. Hmm. So the glove was custom made. <laughs> your honor. I really don't see how this glove is related to this case. Yes, it would seem that there is little relevance. Where is the glove? Is it stolen? Is it gone? Was it gone from the scene of the crime? It would seem that there is little relevance. Re 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 what do you think, Mr. Wright? Yes, the glove was custom made. Custom made. Is this a, is this a meme in the community? That the glove was custom made? I understand that the latter... See, I didn't realize it. That but the ladder thing, the step ladder versus the ladder thing was a whole entire meme in the community. I had no idea. <laughs> it should have hit me when Emma at the end of that last case of the last game said something about the ladder. I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> this prosecutor's whole personality is just nerd. Nerd. If the glove doesn't fit. <laughs> oh 
Oh, she just literally dies. Man. Did did you guys know he made a book and it said it, it says it in like little text, it says if, but it says in huge text, I did it. And I'm like, bruh. <laughs> bruh, that that's so such a weird weird thing. I forgot I got to leave early today, so uh go on to the clock out. Have a good drive home, Karka. Bruh, I know, bruh, bruh. Of course it's relevant. Why are you saying relevant? Relevant. I don't know where this will lead me, but... Of course it is relevant. That glove is the key to this whole case. That's bold. Yes, bluffing to the max. Now this is the Mr. Right I know. I'm so happy you're back, sir. I was wondering how long it'd take. This is great. Food! I can eat! What are you eating? What are you eating? Tell me, tell me, tell me, tell me. Share, 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 share. Post in the Discord. If you haven't, I need to see. Give food, give food, give food, give food. Make me hungry. Pizza! It's a pizza! Hmm. Pressing people. It feels like I've done this before. As if I used to do this to squeeze information from even the most tight-lipped people. Squeeze your juices out of your lips. Very well. If you are that convinced, then let's hear some more about the matter. Brrr. The small if... Um... If was a change ma made by the victim's family. I believe they got the ownership of the books after a court case. Oh. Hmm. Was it supposed to make it, like, you know, look like they said I did it? Or did they add the if? Because they don't want to be like, oh, It's incriminating, even though, you know, the case is over and everything. You can't be tried again for the same case. Yeah. At least OG can rest in peace now, knowing his wife murder is finally gone. Is he... Wait, is he dead? I don't know. I actually don't know. I don't remember. It did take, like, 20-odd years to... Mm-hmm. Were they just waiting for death, uh... Like, three days ago? Whoa, really? Oh, okay. I didn't know that. I was I was waiting to hear, like, three years ago. <laughs> the juice died. Juice is dead. Actually, I brought the glove with me today. And? Why didn't you say so earlier? Hurry and show the glove to the court. That's why I made the joke. Oh! No, because I knew the book came out. Because I saw it on Twitter. Uh, but I didn't know why. That makes a lot more sense. He was on TikTok for a bit? Oh, really? I, did, I haven't been on TikTok in a while. They wanted to do the I did it thing. I did it. I did it. I did it. Well, I didn't think it had anything to do with this case. It's bananas! It's bananas! Yes! Banana! I wonder if it was intentionally supposed to look like bananas. There's no way that was an accident. There's no way. It just looks like a bunch of bananas. Anyway, this is it, sir. Banana! <laughs> Banana? Wait. This content was basically him just going. I might have done. I might done that. <laughs> Make it stop. No. I'll keep going. Also, welcome in turtles. Uh, it's a uh, rather yellow, isn't it? Baseball glove added to the court record. Officer Prince really liked the color yellow, and that's why you had a special order. It. I might have done it. No. Uh, yep, that's right. That and one other reason. What's the other reason? <laughs> I think the court has heard enough. No, you should tell us the other reason. <gasps> Chaos, lock him in! I get with the thrall! It is clear that the victim and the defendant were involved with each other. 
Yes, that's correct, Your Honor. Now, if that is true, it brings up an important question. Was the name Maggie really written by the victim? I see your point, Your Honor. Detective Gumshoe, please tell the court a little more about the name on the ground. Yes, sir. How are you doing, Chaos? Hope you having a good day. We first looked into the handwriting. Unfortunately, we couldn't confirm that it was the victim's handwriting. Can you even say the handwriting's the same? Like, when you're spelling it with your entire hand versus your actual hand, like your pencil in your hand, can, can you even like judge that as the same thing? Spoiler, Darth Vader's Luke's father. No! So, also, what's up in? Runs on at you at all fours. No! <laughs> no! Oh. I forgot my uh, voice was still high pitched. Go! Unless you guys want a high pitched gal. Go! I should turn that up before uh, I do a gal next time. It's high pitched for, uh, for Yinny. Hi, Yinny! <laughs> Next, we checked the victim's pointer finger. We found that there was sand trapped under the victim's fingernail. It just woke up. Give him a second. Oh, no problem. Take your time, Yinny. Um, for some, it is the same. For others, handwriting is different. Oh, interesting. Obi-Wan had the high ground. It's over, Anakin. You're guilty. High up the high ground. <laughs> the high-pitched gal. 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 Also depends on the material. Mm hmm. That makes sense. There were also scratches on his skin that were caused he by worms. him writing on the ground. He worms. From this, we could confirm that the victim wrote this this name with his right hand. Hmm. Yes, a perfectly logical conclusion. Let me guess. He's left-handed because of the glove. Can I see the glove again? Let's see. What glove? What, what direction am I wearing this? That is a glove for your right hand. So that means you're left-handed, sir. I got him. We did it. We solved the case. We're done. Leave. Pack it up. Go home. Go home. That one life. No, we. I need to watch the spinoffs for Star Wars. Got him. Nice clap again. <laughs> Phoenix Puffle! Oh, well, my, my, my message is not popping up, but thank you for the raid! Welcome in, raiders! Hello, hello! <gasps> Kirby Till and Tumble! <gasps> Why isn't my alerts going off? What's going on? <laughs> it is dying for a little bit. Well, hello! Welcome in! How was your stream? How is Kirby Till and Tumble? I haven't played that one. That one's for the Game Boy Advance, right? How is it? Welcome in, raiders! Hello, 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 everybody! My name is Spacey Tora. Space Tiger Variety Streamer and Artist. Uh, we are currently playing Ace Attorney 2. We are in the beginning case, so we just started the game. Uh, Puffle got tilted for the last time ever. <gasps> no. The horrors? No! <laughs> well, welcome in, everybody. Hope everyone is having a good day. I hope you had an amazing stream. I'm <laughs> sad to hear that it was an awful time. And jump in. Jump it! Thank you for the follow. <laughs> Why did that work? And the raid didn't. What? Okay. <laughs> strange. Very strange. But raiders, if you need to go rest, you need to go eat or sleep. Go do. Please go do so. Please, please, please go do what you gotta go do. Um, I need to look into playing more Kirby games myself because I played um like Kirby's Epic Yarn before. And Kirby in the Forgotten Land. But I I really need to play more Kirby. I really need to. We wouldn't be VTubers without scuff. Yeah, man. Sorry you had some scuff. But I hope it was a good time regardless. And please, yes, please go rest. Please, 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 please. Thank you for the raid again. I appreciate it. Raiders, if you need to go as well, I completely understand. But if you do stick around, I very much appreciate it. Um... Like I said, we're playing Ace Attorney. We're gonna, like, hop back into that. 
Uh, take good rest. You can tilt more. <laughs> so you can tilt more. Yes. Tilt in your sleep. <laughs> Counting. <laughs> I have finished 14, 15 Kirby games on stream. Nice. Hell yeah. Well, do you have a favorite Kirby game? I go rest. Oh, sorry. I'm sorry. I'm going to keep you here. Oh, oh, oh. Go look, go look, please. Have fun solving crimes. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you again. I appreciate it. That's a lot of Kirby. Does anyone in chat actually have a favorite Kirby game? This could go for everybody. Kirby Superstar Ultra was my hot. Aw. I need to play that one then. I always like asking people's favorites out of like a series and just being like, oh, I should play that one. I should definitely look into it. Yes, please go rest. Please, please, please. Amazing Mirror was my jam. Ooh, that was that the one on the DS? Is it DS? I know Cursed, the clay one. I don't know their names, though. I played Crystal Shard uh, when I was a kid uh, on the 64. But, like, I never, never played as an adult, so I'm honestly curious going back to that game sometime. I love Kirby Metroid. Oh, Kirby Metroid. That's, I love, dude, Metroid's so good. For real. I only played one Kirby game as a wee lad. Kirby Mass Attack. Oh. Oh, I haven't played that one either. Man, I really need to play more Kirby games. <laughs> I need to open up my, uh, my mind to Kirby. Canvas Curse. Oh, Canvas Yes, 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 yes. That's the one I'm thinking of. The clay one. Hmm, 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 hmm. Wait, I think so? I don't know. I could be confusing them again. I know there were two that were very similar. Remember that King DDD and Forgotten Land is coolish? Dude, King DDD and Forgotten Land is so cool. I love him so much. He's like my favorite character in Kirby. He's so cool. Okay, besides Prince Fluff. Prince Fluff from, uh... Epic Yarn is also really cool. I love him. But DDD has my heart always. I love him. That's Squeak Squad? Oh, Squeak Squad. Uh, that... Man, I just need a list of Kirby games, dang it. I need to just have the picture. If I have the picture of them, um, like their cover art and stuff like that, I'll probably be like, yeah, that one. <laughs> By name, though, I'm really bad at it. I apologize. Also, a good one. That one had power mixing back in a limited way. Mm-hmm. I love the power mixing. That was, like, my favorite thing. I love uh, combining the rock, the stone guy, and the the cutter. So I could make myself into stone sculptures, and I just fly around and land on things. That was my favorite thing to do. That was, like, the only thing I actually really did in that game was uh, get the stone and the cutter. <laughs> uh, I was your enemy, and now I'm your best friend! I love DDD. He's such a freaking good character. And the way they made him in Forgotten Land was like amazing. I love him so much. Like his the way they like made his like style and everything. Maybe we should just play Return to Dreamland. I think that's the I think that's um the one uh that one came out recently, the remake. The one with the time guy. Uh, Return to Dreamland Deluxe is very nice. I've heard it's really good. I, I like the mini games already. Like, I haven't played them, but I've seen them. And I'm like, whoa. That looks really fun. I like it a lot. I want to play it. Um, maybe we should do that on stream sometime. Sometime soon. Because we haven't played a Kirby game in a while, and I really want to. I feel like... I feel like I'd have a lot of fun with it. Uh, I did play the original, though. So I already know how it ends. I already know, like, the whole story and everything. But... I would love to play it regardless. Any Kirby game is good. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, Kirby makes me happy, man. I feel like that's the same for a lot of people. It just it just makes me happy. It, it's a good series. Okay, with that being said, we can still talking about it, but I'm going to start playing uh, Ace Attorney. If anyone is worried about spoilers, um, I understand if you need to go, if you need to lurk, all the things. Thank you again, uh, Puffle, for the raid. I very much appreciate it. Um, enjoy your rest. I want to play Squeak Squad again. Aw. Uh, what was your favorite part about Squeak Squad? You could say you know the Magalore. I... <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> I know the Magalore. <laughs> but yes, uh, with that being said, like I said, we can still talk about it. We can still talk about Kirby, but I will be continuing its journey while we talk about it at the same time. 
Um, oh, right. It's attorney. Completely forgot we were playing that. Yeah, <laughs> I know, right? We keep going off on so many tangents. Oh, Tora, I've been meaning to ask, did you finish P3 Reload? I have not. Uh, I was taking a little bit of break of it because we were playing a couple long games together all at the same time. I think what I want to try to do is maybe do some Persona 3 spaced out a little bit so it's more, like, manageable. Um, and not do it all at once because when I was doing Ace Attorney with Persona 3, I was like, oh, God, we're, we're stuck with these two games for a long time. <laughs> Uh, cause they are really long games. Um, and I want to try to sp do space my time better and, um, do better with that and stuff like that. And so, yeah. Yeah. Hopefully we can return to it soon. Man, I've missed the just chatting streams. Yeah, me do. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm telling you, I need to just have some just chatting streams so I can just chat with you guys. I really want to do that again. I liked it when we did it with the Duck Sim, but I need to think of other games to do that's not just ducks. Um... That we can just do together. Maybe that's an art stream. I don't know. Uh, I feel like art streams are more like, you know, chill. But anyway, I'm getting really off topic. And we can we can plan this <laughs> together sometime. But for now, it's dirty. And now then, Mr. Wright, you may cross-examine the witness. Thank you, Your Honor. It was just a long bit of silence there. Um, with no music. Because that's not where the game was. Dang, we just kept going. Could have got some music when I was doing that. Oh, I just started P3R when not playing Dark Souls 3. Again, I swear, I'm not addicted. No, 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 not addicted at all. No, 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 no. You can stop anytime. Mm hmm, mm hmm. <laughs> just like right now. With P3. <laughs> yeah. We first looked into the handwriting. Unfortunately, we couldn't confirm that it was the victim's handwriting. Next, we checked the victim's finger or er, pointer finger. We found that there was sand trapped under the victim's fingernail. Oh, this is a lot of stuff. There were also scratches on the skin that were caused by him writing on the ground. From this, we could confirm the victim wrote his name with his right hand. Can I please present to you the left-handed freaking baseball glove, please? Did I mean to do that? Objection. Please be right. Please don't tell me I just jumped ahead. <gasps> yes! Yes! Save! Oh, thank you! Thank you for the save! I keep thinking I'm gonna hear a zero escape Shing! when I save. Um, zero escape or AI. Somnium files sound when I save. Detective Gumshoe, take a look at this. Get a load of this. She's so smart, Chad. Ga gosh. Detective, look at this bunch of bananas! I know, right? That's what you were saying earlier. We're like, bananas? Which bananas? Pete. A N A N A yes. Uh, Leopold, welcome in. Uh, but the glove is right-handed too. Right-handed. What well, goes on your right hand? Yes, that's the glove, right? Could you tell the court what is special about this glove? What's special? Um, never really thought about it, but uh, it's really yellow, and that's about it. It is really yellow. <laughs> And has a sticker on it, a little red sticker. It's for sale. Uh, no, that's the glove. Left. Left. <laughs> that's the glove, right? No, left. Left. Yes, it, it's really yellow, but that is only one of its qualities. Oh, good morning, Annie. Go. A go just for you. The glove is right handed, but you know the ball, you throw the ball with the other hand. Yeah, 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 mowning. Mowning. Huh? There's another reason why it's special. And what would that be? It's very simple. This glove is made for a left handed person. Left handed? Why, you're absolutely right! This glove is made to be worn on the right hand. That is why it had to be custom made. I have never seen a bright yellow left-hander's glove for sale, have you? Mm hmm. Well, um, no. So, detective, which hand did the victim use to write the name with again? That's easy. Look, it's obvious from this picture that it was his... Wait a second. Or wait a sec. There was no second. It absolutely left. Ah, oh, damn. Ah, oh, damn. 
Don't forget that the victim was left-handed. What is right when there's nothing left? What is left when nothing goes right? <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Oh. Objection! This is... This is... I mean, I... Object! No, no, no. Overruled. Mr. Wright, I would like to know what your line of reasoning proves. Oh my god, judge, please. There is only one conclusion that can be drawn. The left-handed person cannot have written a message with his right hand. We're not going to mention he might be ambidextrous. We're not going to talk about that. What is a man? A miserable pile of secrets. <laughs> a miserable pile of secrets? <laughs> Therefore, the person who wrote the name Maggie could not have been the victim. We have so many reasons why it could not have been the victim. How are we going to prove it was someone else, though? Order, order! When you think about it that way, then yes. It is not possible that this name was written by the victim himself. Then that means Maggie is... No. It's not po uh, Mr. Payne. Y yes, Your Honor. The evidence that... Er, the evidence the prosecution has presented has failed to prove the defendant's guilt. In fact, I believe you have proven her to be innocent. No! <laughs> All right, you did it, Mr. Wright. Whew. I feel like I can breathe again. It seems that we have reached the conclusion. You did a fine job once again, Mr. Wright. Me, Your Honor? Ah, oh, well, thank you, sir. See, you got complimented by the judge again. You're really good. And that's why you can't give up being a lawyer, sir. You joking? I'm more than ready to retire. You don't even remember if you're ready to retire or not. What do you mean? And you're literally like, what, 26? Like, you're, you're, that's for the young to retire, sir. Why is it called bisexual when it could be called amb ambisexual? Amb <laughs> ambisextrous. <laughs> Man, why that was a mouthful. That's probably why. <laughs> Think about the hydrate. <laughs> we can all agree that Maggie's innocent, but if no one else is guilty, Maggie will be serving a life sentence. Innocent. 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 I will now announce my verdict. We don't even know who did it, though. I'm supposed to prove who did it, even though I don't- I'm not a detective. And you can't object! No! Not yet! This is the first time it's been, like, good for us, and now someone else is, like, um... Trying to be like, NO! NO! That's not true! NO! I mean, please. Er, I mean, please. Give me a few more minutes, Your Honor. What is the meaning of this, Mr. Payne? The prosecution is not finished yet. What, what do you mean? We would like to call our next witness to the stand. Is it the person who did it? Please, what? And what did this witness... witness? The moment the victim was pushed to his death. What's more, he saw the very face of the culprit. I would like to call my next witness the victim. Mr. Pain in my ass. What the heck? <laughs> Mr. Pain in my ass. That's probably what he... I'm assuming that's probably what his name is, right? Because he's a pain in your ass. Order. Order in the court. I believe a recess is in order. Afterward, we will hear from this new witness. Are we real? You're all one collective brain cell, like ants. All one big colony. I had a feeling that this was a bit too easy. I need more information. I'll have to see what I can find out during this recess. I can't let my guard down. It's only going to get tougher from here. Court is adjourned for recess. In actual court, he'd be thrown out the door for not presenting this witness earlier. For real? For real? For real? Save your progress? Yeah. I feel like we did that joke in the last game. Oh, 
save. You see how it says one, 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 two? The last game didn't do that, I'm pretty sure. I think all of my things are final day. Dang it. Oh, that's cool. I like it like this, actually. September 8th, 11.43 a.m. Uh, amnesia! Oh, I can't believe my lawyer's trying to defend me in such a state. Okay, but I did it, though. I'm amazing. Phoenix is amazing. I, uh... Why didn't you tell me, sir? Oh, sorry, I didn't mention it to you. Oh, I know what to do. I heard you can fix something like this with a really strong shock to your system. Come on. Lower your head a little. A Maggie kick should be all you need. Oh, please, no. That's gonna cause it worse. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, man, can I not? You're innocent, please. Don't hurt me. <laughs> what if she killed Phoenix? Guilty! <laughs> Come on. Oh, I already did that one. Uh, no, no, no. I think I'll pass on this one. Come on! Uh, I'm sorry. Whenever I see someone in trouble, I have a hard time leaving them alone. I tend to stick my nose where it doesn't belong and try to tackle everyone's problems. I... feel that. Well, my head's one problem you won't be tackling today. Well, we're here to solve your problem first. You can deal with mine later. Bird straight up said frown. <laughs> Mood, Maggie. I know, right? Mood. For now, do you think you can fill me in on a few things? To give herself brain damage. Here's a head snap. <laughs> of course, I'd be honored to. Ah, uh, well, I guess we'll start with my name and then I can tell you about me. We can deal with mine later. That's so sad. Uh, I know. No, no, that's okay. Really. I think I know you and your name pretty well by now. I was wondering if you could help me figure out a few things about myself. So, my name is Phoenix Wright. What a weird name. Hmm. This is serious. You really don't remember. I'll tell you what, sir. You can have this back and maybe it'll help. This is... A business card? I got this from you! It's my most prized possession. Oh! <laughs> I have a fangirl. You can borrow it for now, but please give it back, okay? I mean, I can just give you a new one. Okay. There are some numbers written on the back. Oh, that's your cell phone number. Phoenix's business card added to the court record. Can I call someone on my phone, please? You got any Yu-Gi-Oh cards? <laughs> got any games on your phone? I guess for now, we should stop talking about me. And start talking about this case. This case? Yep. Can you think of anything that would be helpful for me to know? Um, what can I tell you? Um... Hmm. They're so bad at flirting. <laughs> she should take a lesson from me. I'm really good at flirting by accident. <laughs> She has feathers because her name is Bird. He's Kazooie from Banjo Kazooie. This is how I imagine Kazooie. Except for Kazooie is more foul mouth. Why does the music sound so depressing? I don't know. Probably because we, we don't have any memories. To her for flirting lessons. <laughs> I can't think of anything other than the incident with that cell phone, but. Cell phone? Yeah, and your eyes lit up when we talked about it at the detention center, sir. Hurry up and tell me. This might be very important. Okay, Roger. How? How? Okay, so you see how... I just... I don't know why I thought of it just now. But she has pockets on her chest? How helpful are those pockets? What can you put in those pockets? Like, nothing, right? I don't like chest pockets. Like, if it's like a... Maybe... I don't know. I don't like chest pockets. Maybe it's because I have a, a chest. Mm. <laughs> Maybe because, you know, there's something in the way. <laughs> Not really. They're usually small. More pockets. I just put them in your pants. Just wear cargo pants. I don't really... 
Um, I don't like how baggy cargo pants are, though. F R I D. Uh, cause she's meant to be a cop. Mm mm mm. Hmm. Pens? Oh, maybe pens. Maybe cards or something. Like something flat. More feathers. Oh, that's yes. You're probably right about that one. I think it is more feathers. <laughs> oh, I only like uh pins or glasses. Ooh, pens. Pins could also <laughs> something flat. <laughs> <laughs> it was on the day of the crime, just before 6 p.m. I put pens. Pens! Pens, pens. I picked up a lost cell phone while on a walk with Dustin. Oh. Wait. <gasps> this isn't even our phone! This is the fr- This is the person who murdered's phone is. That's why he hit Phoenix. So you know what happened? I'm sure what happened was like, you know, the guy can't see. He hit Phoenix. He only, all he did was hear the cell phone. He's like, I gotta kill him now. Or maybe Phoenix just had the same cell phone ringtone and he just knocked out Phoenix for no reason. <laughs> the Nokia. <laughs> yeah, the Nokia. The brick. All of a sudden, the phone began to ring. Me, Um, hello? Oh, thank you! I've been searching for my phone! Is this yours? Oh, I'm glad you called. You can meet up and... Uh, wait. We can meet up and I can give this back. I'll be right there. Um, I'm sorry, I didn't catch your name. You can call me Maggie. We agreed to meet up at 6 p.m. Dustin and I waited for the person to show up, but they never did. Hmm. It's a real murder weapon. Those Nokia bricks can be powerful blood weapons. I know, right? Okay, I had a flip phone when I was young. Um. So, like, those... That thing is durable, you know? And I can't imagine, like, a, a, the brick phones, you know what I mean? I've never, like, had a brick phone. I think my mom did, actually. Um... But, like, those things look freaking rough if you got hit by one of those. Uh, the Motorola Razor. Is that the ones that, like, flip up? Like, they have, like, the full keyboard and stuff like that? I never had one of those. I snapped my flip phone on accident. What? On accident? She's a brick house. Tora, please, stop. You're making me feel old. No! Stop! Even I had a brick phone. No. <laughs> Wait, I think it's funny because I think when I got a phone, I think that's when like the iPhones were out and everything too. Um, like I think my mom had uh, a, like the original like iPhones or like, like I don't know, one of the first ones, like second or third or something like that. And I remember being like, "Wow, that's so cool!" And then I look at my phone and look at an older iPhone. And I'm like, "Ooh, <laughs> ooh." <laughs> I just opened it and it snapped on one time. Weird. I didn't do anything different, it just snapped. I was at work and my boss was like, how did that happen? That's so strange. I had a phone with an antenna. Oh. Whoa. Like, I like the really thin antennas, right? Indestructible beast. Beast. Hmm. So where's the phone you found now? I gave it to you already. Or, I gave it to you yesterday. Huh? To me? Is it the phone in my pocket? You mean this? Do you think it has anything to do with the murder? I don't really know, but if my eyes lit up... Oh, who is this? Ah! You're here all along! Oh! 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 Maya! Maya! I wasn't expecting you! Mine was a screw-on antenna. Interesting. <laughs> it's Maya! You're so mean! I called you a million times, but you wouldn't pick up. And when I went to check in the courtroom, everyone had already left. Uh, now, who in the heck is this? Let me guess. I'm supposed to know this girl, too. Hey, good morning, Maggie. 
Oh no, when did Maya come back? So she's been around. Like, she knows Maggie, so she's just been here. <laughs> monkey. Monkey, monkey. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. What did I sound very monkey? <laughs> Even the Nokia Windows phone they made right before they stopped making phones were 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 were, 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 uh, were bricks. I had one from work and I took a five pound pig hammer to the screen and it still worked. What? They don't make phones like they used to. <laughs> Every time Maggie salutes, she knocks ten brain cells loose. I know, right? That's what I'm saying too. Oh, good to see you, Maya. And a good morning to you, too, Maya. So, so, how's it going? Why wouldn't she in court with us? Is there a word for worse than abysmal? What? What do you mean? You are proved innocent! What are you talking about? Oh, and what if I said that everything will be fine? That's right. It's Maya to the rescue with the ultra-decisive, super-important evidence. Here you go, Nick. I, I guess she's not completely proven innocent. Yet, because they had the witness and everything, but still. I still consider her innocent. Here you are, Nick. The thing you wanted me to bring? Huh? Uh, oh, uh, thanks. What the heck is, what the heck is this? A list? It has about 20 people's names and phone numbers written on it. It was kind of tough, but I managed to dig up some dirt. That face, though, when she says that. I swear it was waterproof. Oh, whoa. Dang. They went from, like, waterproof phones to, like, not waterproof phones back to waterproof phones again. <laughs> they should just kept the waterproofing. Uh, we prove there to be a reasonable doubt about the accusation against her. <laughs> Looks like these guys are up to no good. No good? As Ace Attorney goes, the thing ain't over until the consecutive... Er... Conclusivity could could words <laughs> conclusively prove someone else did it. Yes, we need to be a detective. We need to, we are the detective, and we need to prove someone didn't say even that's not in our job description. Same with the stockings. They used to make stockings that would last for a year or longer, and then figured out that they couldn't make as much money with that. Ah, uh, yeah, capitalism, baby. Love money. <laughs> There's a group of con artists the police are currently investigating. I think these guys are members of that group. Why would a group of con artists pop up in a case like this? Oh no, guess we're insane. Yeah, I can imagine. Don't look at me. Hmm. And where did you get this list from in the first place? What? You don't remember, Nick? You're the one who asked me to look this up yesterday. Nick, please just tell Maya what happened. Tell her, please. Oh, is that right? These numbers were in the memory of that phone Maggie found. Hmm, so that's where they're from. You're awfully forgetful these days, Nick. It's your old age, Nick. You're only 26 and you're so old. Oh my god. Oh my god, shut up. <laughs> I'm so offended right now. <laughs> I hope I never get to be a forgetful old prune like you. Dude, how old is she? I'm gonna freaking yeet her into the sun. <laughs> I, uh, what was she before? Like, um, 17, 16? Something around there? Yeet her into the sun. Or I guess it's dialogue counter. One. <laughs> um, Maya. Actually, Mr. Wright is... Mr. Wright, recess is now over. Please bring the defendant and return to the courtroom immediately. Is 18 in this one? Oh, okay. Oh, oops. Guess you have to get going. She's only like... She's less than 10 years younger. Yeah, younger than Nick. Like, what the... <laughs> Stop it. I mean, I guess when you're 18, too. Everyone just seems... Like, like little ages, like, like two years, seem like a lot to you. So, I guess that makes sense. Also, on old phone rant mode... Uh, I think I made a lot of less typos on the old phone, Blueberry keyboards and touchscreen keyboards. I also agree. Because I think when it came to... Because I had a flip phone, right? Um, it wasn't like a full keyboard or anything like that. 
So I had to like type like if it was um uh the number one button. So I had to type to get to C. I had to type it three times. Uh, so you know, one, two, three, one, and then T cat. <laughs> you know what I mean? It's like you had to think about it. I think a little more to type things out. Whereas now, I feel like I'm. I think this is where my ADHD is coming in. It's coming in clutch right now. <laughs> it's uh, making it really worse because I will skip words when I type things out. I do this in the Discord all the time. If you guys notice I do that, I'm so sorry. <laughs> um, I try to edit it and fix it if I do see it and notice it, but it's like... I try to reread it and I still think I don't see it sometimes. Some, I don't know. It's just horrible. I hate my brain. Uh, the first really big industry cartel was back when they conspired to drastically reduce the lifetime of light bulbs. I remember that! They used a different material. They used to use, um... Shoot, what was the material they used? Uh, I'll help with yeeting. <laughs> help me, I need all the help I can get. I'm weak. Tungsten. I thought tungsten was now. Is, is it tungsten used to be the one they used to use, and now they use something else? Because I remember they made light bulbs... Because I remember like watching a TV show where they'd last for years. Like years, years. Tungsten filaments. I getcha, I gotcha, I gotcha. Yeah, man. Now they're LED. Mmm, yeah, dang. God dang, those kids and their LEDs. I almost said LADs. <laughs> Damn, no, I'm not, I'm not, I actually probably makes it funnier. Damn, no, I'm not as kid and those LADs. <laughs> Blinding me. Back in my day, we had burned ourselves on our light bulbs. LADs are now the primary. Mm -hmm. Are LADs, do LADs last a while? Or do, are they pretty, they burn out? Pretty fast. Anyway. <laughs> Oh, oops. I guess you have to get going. We can talk about you getting old later, Nick. What the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck is this? Those damn RGB lightings. <laughs> oh. And just like old light bulbs, the brighter and shorter life they have. Hmm. Sad. So sad. LEDs last pretty long. Hey, hell yeah. Nice, nice, nice. I have LEDs on my desk. Um... I never turn them on, though. I, I never, like, see the point in, like, you know, using electricity that I don't need to use. So I never use lights that are pointless. <laughs> so now I just have these lights that are underneath my desk that I just never use. LED headlights in cars should be burned in hell. For real. They hurt my eyes so much, man. It depends on which, um, phosphorus compounds you want to use. Ah! See, I used to be really knowledgeable about this stuff, and then I just, no, no, no more. I used to love freaking science. Now it's like I don't really learn much about science unless it's like on the internet. I, I need to consume more science because I love it. A phoenix just getting roasted. Roasted phoenix. Does anyone else hate those yellow light bulbs that... And prefer the white ones? Because I do. Hmm. I have to think about that. I'm not sure. I'm being a dork about electric... Uh, oh no, I love it. Please keep talking about electronics. I like... In this chat, please talk about your special interests. Because <laughs> I love that. I love learning about people's, like, interests. Especially because it's like, I don't know about stuff like this. So other people knowing about it and telling me about it makes me kind of more knowledgeable as well. I like it. So keep doing it, please. Cold white light bulbs suck. Light bulbs. They're so bright, right? Wish us luck. Salutes. Hit head. Oh. <laughs> I guess I have all the pieces now, more or less. Mark, welcome in. How are you doing? Hope you're having a good day. All that's left is to put it all together. I'm not going to lose this. I can't. Even for the hydrate and the stretch. Come on, Nick. Better get a move on. And thank you. I'm proud of you. Thank you for being proud of me. Thank you for the posture check. Give me some 3k warm white white bulbs. I almost said white blobs. White lubs. <laughs> Save my eyeballs. Yeah. My white bulbs. 
White blobs. <laughs> White blob. Court will now reconvene. Please call your next witness to the stand, Mr. Payne. White blobs. White blobs. Yes, Your Honor. But before I do, if I may say a few words. What is it, Mr. Payne? It's about the next witness. He has a tendency to say things that rub people the wrong way, you see. So I ask that the court might be a little lenient on... <laughs> there is no need to give a pref er, preface. Preface? Preface. Preface. <laughs> Just hurry up and call your witness, please. Yes, Your Honor. The prosecution calls its next witness. Witness. Due to my master's thesis, my special interest right now are ginkgos. I have learned way more about the plant than I ever wanted to. <laughs> if you don't mind me asking, like, um... Uh, why ginkgos? A drifter who was taking a walk in the park on the day of the murder. Oh my god, it's him! Please state your name for the court witness. Oh my god, he's such a freaking pretty boy. Before I do, I would like to clarify a little something. Huh? Oh, right. Go ahead. Just now, you introduced my wonderful self. Oh god. Just now, you introduced my wonderful self to the court, correct? Perhaps as a drifter who was taking a walk. Did I? But I will not stand for that. Now you've tinted the court's eyes and colored me wrongly. I hate this man. <laughs> oh god, he's talking fast. Wait, I can't read that fast! I can't- stop! 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 I'm beautiful! No! You need to stop talking! <laughs> I don't like when it just goes by itself like that. I can't do anything. I wish there was a, um... A way to look back at your freaking text, man. I want to read what he has to say, but it went so fast, I, I reacted to it, and then missed the second line, then I was just confused. Yes, I understand. I'm very sorry. I will be more careful from now on. What is he? A human chatterbox? No, that's most old bag. <laughs> uh, I have to question him. I want to cut your hair. Fashion, cars, women, glasses, glasses. And of course, university. First rates only need apply. Would you say these glasses are expensive? Would you say that they're a top brand? Hmm? Hmm. Sir, you're not wearing any glasses right now. You could be missing some glasses. I'm just saying. <laughs> Glasses? But you weren't wearing glasses yet! He was! At the moment he thought. That's enough. Your name, witness. Oh, is that how you want to play this? Using your power and influence to keep the young people down? I see how you work now. My bug, welcome in, welcome in! Hello, hello! You old pe. <laughs> You old people and your dirty tricks. You thought you had me, but you thought wrong. Uh, I'm sorry, it won't happen again. Judge, you're the judge! Shut up! Th throw s show some authority, sir! His gingos have stayed pretty much unchanged for nearly 100 million years for that reason. You can find out several interesting things by comparing fossils with recent leaves. Interesting. Huh, I like that. I appreciate you sharing. Punch him, just punch him. I will, I want to. Saying, is this how you want to play this to the judge is insane, I know, right? He's just asking to get put in jail. Oh, man. I forgive you. All right, I suppose I can tell you my name. <laughs> I want to be like, you were in the presence. Of, I am Richard Wellington, the drifting virtuoso. Virtuoso? Well, I don't know. <laughs> With a PhD in drifting, as it were. If you wanted to, you could call me a 
university student in transit. I forgot about that. Uh, some of the fossilized ginkgos are still quite same. Wow, that that is crazy. Like, what makes them? What what makes them so perfect? That they never need to evolve. Like, because the harsh weather back then used to be insane, you know? The fact that they never had to evolve to nowadays is insane. Any realization to Beef Wellington? <laughs> hmm. <clears throat> Mr. Wellington, on the day of the murder, you were taking, uh, uh, strolling through the park, correct? The crocodiles and horseshoe crabs. Yeah! Dude, horseshoe crabs? Crocodiles are, like, not as crazy to me. Maybe because we see them more often. But horseshoe crabs are wild. You know what I mean? Like, they don't look from this time. And of course, they're, like, you know, never need to evolve. So, <laughs> they're perfect in every shape and form, just like crocodiles. Uh, genetic drift for some uh, grinkos and ferns didn't happen. That's crazy. Ingos very nearly went extinct in the last ice age, so they probably should have adapted a bit. Oh, true. Maybe they're just really quick to adapt. That's so crazy. Elm shoe shrimps. Shimpsy bugs. Shimpsy bugs. Everything become crab. Oh, true. 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 Everything crab. As a judge, keep his license for. <laughs> Cow throwing to the more insolent witnesses is beyond me for real. It would appear that you are attached to that word. If you must, then by all means. But I remind you that I am in no way a prepubescent boy out on a walk with mummy. <laughs> Shut up. I want to put him in jail. Anyway, please testify to this court that you saw or what you saw during your walk to the park. See, you said it again. Taking a walk. You know you. What you witnessed will do, Mr. Welling Wellington. I almost said Wellington. Wellington. Carsonization, my beloved. <laughs> looks pretty prepubescent to me. <laughs> he literally looks like he's 17. Or at least, you know, the way his like, hair and eyes are. I was in the park all afternoon, deep in thought about my life situation. I don't remember the time all that well, but I do believe it was past 6 p.m. 22. Okay. All of a sudden, a police officer falls from above. Look at his face. All of a sudden, a police officer falls from above, right in front of my eyes. Without the thought, I looked up, and there I met the eyes of a charming young lady. Of course, I remember her sweet face. It was that of the pretty defendant there. The o only other thing I saw was the banana that fell <laughs> with the puffy sauce. <laughs> the banana. Banana. Hmm, that was certainly a decisive testimony. Decisive? Nick, did you hear what he just said? Yeah. That's all I have to say? How can you be so calm? It's strange. My mind is very calm and clear. Maybe it's because I believe in my client. You mean Maggie? Yes. And if she really is innocent, then that can only mean one thing. That guy is lying. Ah, bah, 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 bah. Ah, bah, 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 bah. Shimpsy's bugs. Shimpsy's bugs. You may now question the witness, Mr. Wright. There might be a song on Weezer's Green Album called Crab. 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 I might have to look it up. I'll find out the truth, no matter how well you craft your lies. I was at the park all afternoon, to even thought about my life situation. What was your life situation? So you were at the park all afternoon? You seem to have a lot of free time. <laughs> that was very rude of you. But then again, what can I expect? Hey, Jaris, welcome in. I hope you're doing well. 
Uh, that's what you get from a man who graduated from a no-name trashy university. No name? Trashy? I do have a name. Uh, what was it again? <laughs> Are you doing that with your mouth? Your mouth. What the guy? <laughs> your mouth. Known as the Green Album is a song called Crab. The Crab in all caps. <laughs> now, this might be hard for a mush headed, feeble minded baboon like you, but I have to think very carefully about my future of our great country. But I thought you said you were thinking about which college to go to just now. Where is my up, right, down, down, down? Let me throw it at him. Is that an eagle airstrike? Or is that a. I don't know what that is. I, I do not know the, co the commands by heart. Is Wellington dumb or just stupid? Yes. Yes. A uh, police. Which university I go to will directly affect the very future of this country. Of Japanifornia. Mm -hmm. Objection, your honor. The witness is being a jackwit. He's being down smash. <gasps> yes, down smash, down smash, down smash. We can up B and then slam right it down into him. Objection him. I feel like if Phoenix Wright was in Smash Brothers, or his left B would just be the objection. Just throw objection, 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 objection at people repeatedly. 500 uh, kilogram, kilogram, kg, eagle, yeah, eagle, eagle, eagle. The arrogant little snot. He is snot. I don't remember the time all that well, but I do believe it was past 6 p.m. How did you know that what time it was? I see you're not wearing a watch, so... Silly man! <laughs> silly man thing! Every time I see silly man, I think of Lady Demetrasque's silly, silly man thing. Would you like to know his moveset? I can go find it. Oh, hell yeah, do it. Is it too late for me to recommend murder? Murder is still on the cards. We still could do that. Neutral special, he wields a gun. <laughs> oh, he just starts throwing evidence at people. <laughs> That'd be kind of funny, actually. Objection, your honor. No. -uh. No. -uh. Someone get Marvel vs. Copcom right. <laughs> is that the best you can do? Do you think you can discredit me like that? You're just a third-rate, biased fool. I guess I can't expect real smarts from you. <laughs> Whenever I think of Demetrask, I think of a post that's like, stupid man thing, I'm fucking ballin'. <laughs> and she's doing a sick basketball duck. I need to see that right now. If anyone can find that, please send it in the Discord or something, because I really need to see that. <laughs> oh. Hey, Mithra, want to see me do a flip? <gasps> wait, wait, yeah! I love that video so much, Kim. You have no idea. Like, the <laughs> hey, Mithra, do you want to see, wanna see me do a flip? Uh... <laughs> and then doing the flip, and she's just like, ta-da! <laughs> just... I need to see that video again, too. I love that video so much. I watch it so many times. I love this video so much. She is like, yeah. Oh, press harder. Oh, snot. Oh! I think it thought you posted a link. Or, or did you did post a link. Ooh. Mmm, stream element not happy. You're good, you're good, you're good. Um, if you can, like, you know, um, I know you're not, um, don't want to join, like, Discord or anything like that, but if you want to, like, send it to, like, uh, oh, you can just do it! Do it now! Wait. Oh, there it goes. Yay, Haley! Thank you for sending it. I will click it now, because I want to see it. <laughs> yeah! It's so funny. Mitra! It's so good! <laughs> I forgot! It was when, um... 
Um, um, what's his name came out? Automod, when will you learn? Never, Automod will never learn. I think it's hilarious. It's so good! I love it so much. And then just gets bodied. Like, yeah, Kazuya, that's his name. Thank you. I don't play very many fighting games, as you probably realized when I were talking about it earlier, but... Um... Damn, I love this video so much. <laughs> it's so good. Answer the question. How did you know what time it was? Check in in the background. <laughs> tisk tisk. I can't believe I have to deal with a worm like you. I cannot believe I have to deal with a hee hee worm like you. Kazuya wants to fight. <laughs> Okay, that was pretty good. Yeah, like a myth they're just acknowledging it too. It's like, yeah, <laughs> that was pretty good. He <laughs> worm. Oh, worm? Worm. I I think it's hilarious, by the way. It was in King's stream last night. Um, and King found a worm and called it the lamb. And uh he -he people worms. There were like, what was that, four or five people in chat that went hee-hee -he worms, and I'm like, oh, <laughs> And I'm sitting here like, once again, my legacy. <laughs> my legacy of hee hee worms <laughs> just continues. And it makes me so happy. <laughs> would you like me if I were a worm? Yes. I would I would like you if you were if you were a worm. Oh meow. Meow. Uh, you're just a shallow man thing. <laughs> who who can only slam on desk and point at people for fun. I do like pointing at people for fun. How did you know that? Your reach is far from lasting. <laughs> I think King has damaged us. <laughs> damaged. <laughs> Listen, King gives a worm a hee hee worm. It all works out, because King Worm Jangle. Wait, where did hee hee worms come from? Like, what did I say? Like, besides saying hee hee worms, why did... Bing Kong Gangles... Bing Kong Gangles, where are your worms? What stream was it that I said hee hee worms? I don't know where it came from. Does anyone remember at all? Because I don't... Xenoblade 3? Well, I feel like a lot of my sound clips have come from Xenoblade 3. It's like hee hee worms... Damn! Has also come from that one too. Are you gay or just crazy? Both. He <laughs> he <laughs> worms. He <laughs> I said you had stomach worms. Oh, <gasps> that's right! <gasps> it's because I had parasites! <gasps> oh my god! <laughs> I feel like I totally forgot. So if you guys don't know, it was like what is it, a year and a half ago? I had like I suspected that parasites in my belly. And I was like, fudge. So I, w I started saying a weird voice and I went, he worms! And that has stuck around ever since. And that pin worms. No, I still, I still stand by that I took the worm medicine and I was the best I've ever felt, ever. And I'm like, whoa, that medicine does wonders. I only drink like a tiny bit of it. I don't know, it's crazy. Oh, there it is, he he worms! Oh my god, Tola. What? <laughs> nah, good times, but also bad times, because I was freaking out back then as well. Like, I was like, no. The only thing I know from Xenoblade 3 is water. 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 Me too. <laughs> water. I remember that. It was about when I stayed to watch you. Aw. And I appreciate you sticking around. <clears throat> I guess I don't have a choice. Why did that auto mod stop a worm emote? <laughs> Hello? Why did it stop a worm? <laughs> I'm sorry, Fur. I don't know what that was about. That's so strange. I'll try to explain it so that even a third rate simple. <laughs> third rate simpleton like you can understand. I'm sorry, but every. We're talking about Xenoblade, and they said Simpleton, and I'm like, what's happening? <laughs> because uh, they call Mithra Simpleton, 
and uh, the Xenoblade 2 Torna. Everything is Xenoblade. Oh, it goes back to Xenoblade, man. Smart detection beta. Banned. Worms. Worm banned. Do a worm flip. Flip. <laughs> this is so funny to me. There was this little thing they call a clock at the park. Did you get that? Do you know what a clock is? It's a thing that tells you the time. Everyone hates Mithra. No, I love Mithra. I love Mithra a lot. <laughs> Aww. A simpleton? <laughs> Aw, oh, man. Man, I love Xenoblade. Oh, I want to play Xenoblade more. Even though I've played it already. I just want to play it again. Say that again. See what happens. <laughs> no, I mean, this was basically everyone in Torn. Oh, yes. I, I knew what you meant. At least I knew. <laughs> I like Mithra, though. I like Mithra. I like her growth is really great. I love it so much. But yes, everyone in Torn hated Mithra. I felt so bad. But I think it also contributed to, like, her character growth as well. Um, which is sad, but, like, mm, I think she's cute. Dude, she's so cute. I like her more than Mithra. Or, not Mithra. Pyra. Sorry. I had Mithra on the brain. It's just Mithra. All Mithra. All the time. Oops, all Mithra. <laughs> <laughs> think about the Hydra. I need that. <laughs> I need to be saved. I love Pyra. Don't get me wrong. I love them both, but... Chat, is this real? What? <laughs> Mithra, Mithra, Mithra. Lady Morag is still the goat. Yes! Okay, I feel like we're going to be going on a tangent about <laughs> Xenoblade, because I will. I will. I definitely will go on a tangent about it. Considering uh, what Pyro is supposed to be, uh, yeah, Mithra is the better character. Mm -hmm. I mean, they're both just really good characters, man. Oops, all Mithra. <laughs> Oops, all Mithra. Morag. More like my beloved, for real. And Poppy, my precious. Yeah! Aw, oh, man. Oh, I want to play it again. Would you guys be, um... Would you guys want to see me play Xenoblade 2? You know how I played it before? Um... I, 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 really, I think I really want to play Xenoblade 2 at some point. Or Xenoblade 1 and 2. We played 2. Do it, do it, do it, do it! Dude, I want to. I want to gush over the game. I want to gush over it so bad. You have no idea. You know what? I will. I will play two. Because I really want to. I know I have a lot of games on my backlog right now, but maybe we'll find a place to put in Xenoblade 2. Because I really do want to play it. Believe me. I will gush for hours over this game. And that is perfect for, you know, playing it and everything. And get it out of my system. But then keep it in my system, because then I'll talk about it more. <laughs> As you can see, Mr. Wright. Oh, wait, this is pain. As you can see, Mr. Wright, it's even in the picture of the crime scene. Oh, so it is. I looked at that clock, and that's how I knew the time. How do you... How do you experience a murder? And then think, I need to look at the clock. I, I feel like if you're... If you just witnessed a murder, you would be so panicked, and you probably wouldn't even look at a clock. I'm just saying. I'm not telling you how you, you know, live your life, but, like... That is not my first thought, is to look at the clock. I love Mithra more than Mithra. It's not something I expected to hear. <laughs> yes. Two is to most replayable out of the three. Yeah, I think so too. I feel like, cause you, cause you get the, um, you get the pulls and stuff like that, the gotcha and stuff like that. And it's like, you can experience more characters than you probably would have otherwise. I looked at that clock, and that's how I knew the time. But if you ask me, this whole... I'm not even gonna bother to read what he said. I looked away, because I was like, nah, screw you, dude. I'm not even... You don't even deserve me to read what you have to say. And yet again, another flood of meaningless words. Talk about a first-class waste of time. <gasps> Got him. In any case... All of a sudden, a police officer falls from above, right in front of my eyes. Without a thought, I looked up, and there I... And there I met the eyes of a charming young lady. Why would she jump off? I f um... Are you sure you got a good look at her face? 
animals have this thing called an eye, Mr. Right. They use this eye to see things. In, this, in the case of humans, we have two of them. Yes, even you. Shut your mouth. <laughs> Uh, why, uh, why would he be panicked? Other people don't matter to him. Any- another dead body is the same as dirt on this- Okay, true. That is the kind of person he is, huh? He basically said, uh, that he is too posh to wear a wristwatch. What the fuck, man? I don't like you. That small feeling of maybe I'll get that 0.1% blade keeps the gotcha system fun somehow. You should know the one. Yes, I do. I'll never get them. <laughs> I don't care if you have them or not. Did you or did you not get a clear look at her face? You can't object me. That's what the witness was just about to get to. I would like to request that Mr. Wright not use such a loud voice during questioning. Sustained. Mr. Wright, please refrain from raising your voice in this court. Literally, that's how I say objection. Uh, I found the bawling video and put it in the Discord. Let's go! Thank you, Knack. I appreciate it. You just made the perfect impression of King, really? This is how you know I spend too much time with King. <laughs> then please, don't make me have to raise my voice! Are you finished? I'd like to continue, if that's alright with you. I need you to just shut your mouth. Please, tape a shell. Of course, I remember her sweet face. It was that of the pretty defendant there. Your Honor, I was at, I was going to ask that he just get a life in prison. But no, I'd like to change it to death penalty. Motion granted. That'd be so mean. I would hate that. Also, I'm gonna save, because I haven't saved in a while. So you're sure you are not mistaken? Please, don't confuse your pitiful train wreck of a life with mine. Rude. I am what you call a famous brand name product, while you are only a cheap imitation. Joke's on you. When it has to do with food, it comes from the same place. They just have a different freaking branding on it. So it's the same freaking product, you little fucking asshole. <laughs> Uh, there is no way someone as magnificent as myself could have made a mistake. Of course, of course. The judge is freaking deaf if he honestly has not heard all those insults thrown at right. I know. <laughs> you know that one video of um, the Phoenix right being like... Or I think it was Edgeworth. Oh, no, no, it was all right. He's like, objection! You made fun of me. <laughs> Wellington is beyond arrogant. He's so- I'm gonna freaking tie him up and throw him up a cliff. <laughs> That's murder, Tora. And? <laughs> a murdering a murderer is still murder. Oh, of course. Did you notice anything else of interest, witness? The only other thing I saw was the banana that fell with the police officer. Objection! You made fun of me. <laughs> I am the law. I am the judge, jury, and executioner. And you get that penalty. The banana? Well, it was actually more than just one. More like a bunch of bananas. No, that would be a bunch of bananas be doing there. Or what would it be? <laughs> what would a bunch of bananas be doing there? And why would I know such a thing? I'm only telling you what I saw. That's really strange. Maggie never mentioned anything about a bunch of bananas. That's it, Nick. He gotta be lying about the bananas! Hmm, he could be, but... There's no reason for him to lie about there being bananas at the crime scene. And what if it's not a lie? Well, maybe he thought he was seeing one thing and it was something else. If he mistook something else for a bunch of bananas, then... That would be an inconsistency. Think, Phoenix, think! If my client is innocent, there's no way he could have seen what he says he did. The A N A N A S. It's bananas! E A N A N A S! Bananas. Bananas. 
Looks like Phoenix Wright was Phoenix stupid. <laughs> Dude, I love the video. I've seen it so many times. <laughs> it's so good. Oh, man. The, even the judge would be like, deserved. <laughs> deserved. He got deserved it. Which means if we can somehow show he's lying. Yeah, that's exactly what we need to do. She's right. She's got a sharp mind. I mean, she's been with us for like a whole year or whatever. Yeah. Thank you for the nyas. Did someone say nya? Nya. But nya nya? She's right. She's got a sharp mind. But I just wish I could remember who she is, Nya. Is everything okay, Nick, Nya? I was at the park all afternoon, deep in thought about my life situation, Nya. Is this is a posh, Nya. No, no way, but Nya, Nya. Nya? Nya, Nya, Nya? I remember sweet face, Nya. Only thing I remember was a bananas! Oops! I pressed the button. Yeah. Objection! Bananas aren't real! <laughs> Mr. Wellington! Yeah. I believe I have the bananas you saw right here! Yeah. Angry voice. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, so you knew about the bananas too! Yeah. Why didn't you say so earlier? Yeah. Because you're a mean to me! Jensen, thank you for the hydrate! Welcome in! I hope you're doing well. Yeah. I don't think you can use this as a way to pull more information out of me, Nya. And that's where you'd be wrong. Mr. Wright, what is the meaning of this, Nya? You're not meant to be a cat girl, Toa. What do you mean? Nya. I have... I am tiger. I have cat ears and tail. I have a cat girl, Nya. Sorry, gal. <laughs> oh. Isn't that a baseball glove? Go. <laughs> huh? A, what? A baseball glove, Nya? Doesn't it look delicious, Nya? Care for a bite? Go, Nya. <laughs> that's... That's not... It's... It's a... No! Nya. Your honor. I think this proves one very important fact, Nya. Our defendant is blind! No, there's nothing about baseball. He's bad eyes, so he makes lost bananas. <laughs> I mean, I love my bananas. I love bananas. Bananas are good. I, I wanted to get some bananas at the store the other day. But they were, none of them were, like, green. So I didn't want to get them. Because as soon as I buy them, they're going to go bad. Is this real, Nya? Is this real, Nya? I'm meowing in your ear right now. I'm meowing in your ear. Nya, nya, nya. I love bananas, Nya. I love bananas. Now I'm hungry for bananas, Nya. <laughs> yeah, he has bad eyesight. By the way, just how bad are your eyes? Huh? How? What? You... Why are you asking me about this all of a sudden? Just get green nanas. I didn't have any green nanners. He only had yellow nanas. Yeah. This witness knows nothing about baseball. He can never be ballin'. <laughs> oh, he's the leader of the bunch. You know him well, Lington. <laughs> you know him well, Lington. And he's come back to kick some tail, huh? D.K. Donkey Kong. D.K. Donkey Kong is here. He's finally back. He thinks so, though. You either make bananas, innuendo, or just accuse him of being a fucking casual. <laughs> oh. Your Honor, it, it is very simple to mistake a glove for a bunch of bananas. No, I don't think so. <laughs> I mean, they do look like bananas, but I'm gonna say for this one time, to win our case, it does not look anything like bananas. No, I don't think so. Objection overruled. Y you You're one of those people. Yes, you know what I mean. Oh, he's biting his lip real hard. You gotta rip his lips off. Oh, God, no. Possibilities? 
in the end. It doesn't even matter. And that is why I asked you how bad your eyesight is. Uh, yeah. Buy the yellow bananas and make banana pudding. And when the rest of them turn brown, make banana bread. I do. That's what I did with my last banana. I made banana bread. It was so tasty. I love banana bread a lot. They're they're both twenty two hundred. That's bad. <laughs> You're saying your vision is twenty out of two hundred? Really? Really? I've come so far, yeah. <laughs> In the end, yeah. It doesn't even matter, yeah. <laughs> Where am I then? Welcome in. Welcome in again. I suppose you're gonna tell me that's terrible, right? How did you know? I didn't even read that far ahead. I already was like, that's terrible, man. Doesn't even matter. <laughs> that's worse than my vision. Me too. Why are you not wearing your glasses today, then, yeah? I'm shaking. <laughs> I agree with your banana bread, but consider this banana waffles. <gasps> I've never had banana waffles. You're making me want bananas. I'm gonna have to go get some bananas. It starts with one. Yeah. I have redeemed the nya, but I think we're all the winners today. <laughs> yeah. Get in the nya lock. Because <laughs> it makes me look like a nerd, Your Honor. Your Honor! Glasses are for nerds! I can't be seen. I can't be caught dead where I knows. No. I'm surprised he doesn't have contacts. Um, that's because I lost them recently, you see. Of course, I was planning on getting a new pair made right away. But, you know, my glasses are no ordinary glasses, so to replace them... How about when you witnessed the crime? Were you wearing your glasses then? Oh, he just strangled himself for a second. Ooh, his neck was long too, I think. Oh, that was freaky. How about it, witness? You are an unrelenting evil man. You're like... Joan of Arc. Uh... 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 Which boils down to you were not wearing your glasses at that time. Therefore, the identity of the woman at the scene of the crime and that of the defendant could not be proven to be the same by this witness. But the height difference was only nine feet! What? What? what huh? I think I'm park at the Catboy world. Be like I've become so yum. <laughs> I'm so yum, innocent. I'm innocent. <laughs> oh my gosh, God, crack me up! Oh my God. You know what? You should have waffles with bananas and Nutella. I still need to do Nutella. <laughs> I still need to try it. What have we become? Gods! Become as gods! Become as gods! <laughs> it was very possible for him- That's a nine-foot wall? Holy shit! It was very possible for him to see the face of the copper sitting in the upper path! Hmm. Witness. Please be more accurate in your testimony. Remember, a person's life is at stake. Y yes Your Honor. Nutella. Nutella. Now then, please continue with your testimony. Please tell the court what happened next. Wait, I'm giving him a different voice. Please tell the court what happened next in the moments after you witnessed the crime. God has forsaken Yannis. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> We're all going to be saying Nya the rest of the day. The girl on the upper path ran away as soon as she realized I was there. You said she jumped down! You liar! What is wrong with you? I got that right, correct? Like, he said she jumped off the wall. Like, she came down, laying in front of him, and that's how he saw her. Right? Please tell the court about the bananas. I... I meant the glove. <laughs> the man is on excessive amounts of narcotics. 
the Arcanics. After that, I immediately called the police station to report the crime. I, it must have been 6.45 p.m. when I made the call. Wow, that, that corresponds with my... Uh... My records of the cell phone we have of yours. <laughs> they must have a lot of free time on their hands since they showed up within 10 minutes. More like an excessive amount of... Nyarchism. Nyar... Nyarcism. Nyarcism. I understand. I can't read. <laughs> if the bananas don't fit, you must call... Uh, uh, you must acquit. Acquit. Hmm. As someone who wears glasses, if you're nearsighted, you're... There's no way he could see the details of a face, let alone a glove from the bunch of bananas. Exactly. Like, my... I'm... I'm, uh... I can't see things up close. I have to wear, you know, glasses for that. Um, but, um, like, for example, I can see that the dude has a beard. And if I squint, I can see his eyes a little bit, but that is it. Like, I can't see his nose. I can't see his, uh, anything else, you know? Ebnya, <laughs> yeah. So the person who was on the upper pass saw you and then ran away. Yes, that is correct. Which is why even someone without a superior brain like mine can understand that. That girl is the murderer! Murderer. You may question the witness now, Mr. Wright. I already know what to say. Do you want down, Misty? Hydrate? Thank you for the hydrate plum. Good morning! They go to stretch as well. Hey, girl. The girl on the upper path ran away as soon as she realized I was there. I really want to just say he's wrong here. Uh, nearsighted person. I just see hair. Yeah, like a blob of color. She ran away. Just like that? Yeah, she did. She saw me and I flew the nest, or she, wait, she saw me and flew the nest like the guilty bird she is. Oh, I'm sorry, was that pun too hard for someone who only got a third-rate education? Please let me murder this man! <laughs> Actually, that did take me a few seconds to get. Phoenix. <laughs> Phoenix, 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 Phoenix. Actually, if she ran away. You know what I really realized? She's a bird. We're a bird. We're both birds. Flew the nest. Why there's such an asshole, Nya? <laughs> Your Honor, it was self-defense. She had a knife. <laughs> they had bananas. I'm allergic! <laughs> Ren has learned to turn out the insult, or tune out the insults, I know, right? Anyway, if she ran away the instant she saw you, how could you tell it was my client? You're such a cutie bird, am I a bird? Tiger bird. No, wait, I, I was gonna say, like, speaking of, like, the other animals that I am, I would. <laughs> I was just like lurking in stream and I was called a golden retriever again and I was like, oh, <laughs> like my head whipped around. I was like, oh, <laughs> what? <laughs> it's like, okay, I'm just, I, I just have to accept that I'm just a golden retriever. And you just need to rebrand completely. Your honor, the defendant pointed the banana at me like it was a gun and I felt threatened. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> ah, you shoot the banana at me. <laughs> I believe that, yeah. Your Honor, it was self-defense. He was being a fucking asshole. He deserved the banana dead penalty. You have the sweetest personality, Nya. Oh, wait, no, don't say that. I get soft. No. No. Your Honor, I didn't like his vibes. Here's Golden Retriever of some grass. <laughs> what grass? <laughs> you want to pee on it? <laughs> like what? <laughs> The witness has already answered that question. 
He has stated that the defendant is the culprit. This is true, Mr. Wright. I'm striking your question from the record. Hmm. How can I get more information out of him? What the fuck, yeah? What the fuck, fuck, man, yeah? Manya, manya? Manya, manya. What, pee on your grass? <laughs> After that, I immediately called the police station to report the crime. I feel like it could either be his cell phone. Um, think about the right things, Emmy. <laughs> I think it can either be a cell phone, that's the thing we need to object to, or like that she jumped off. Like, she, he literally said she jumped off the wall. Can I look at my stuff? 640, you say? Can I. Bro, no. How do I. I can't read this? <gasps> oh. Why can't I read these? Can I just not? Well, I guess I'm not... I guess I can't see his thing, so I guess that's not a thing. Aura Aura redeem? Ooh! What kind of Aura... Oh, 10,000 points, let's go! What kind of Aura Aura would you like? Aura Aura Nya? Do you want me to do a, a, a Nyara Nyara? <laughs> not like that, but like... <laughs> a, a Nya at the end of the Aura Aura. Do it. I can do both. I can do both. Ara, Aranya. And then I'm gonna I can do that. The Nyara. <laughs> the Nyara Nyara. Nyara Nyara. I don't like that one as much. <laughs> you don't like that one as much. It didn't come out as good as I wanted it to. Ara, Ara. Yeah, I give a free one because I feel like I screwed it up. <laughs> Didn't need to, but I did it anyway. What? That was a legitimate question. How does the judge even trust this witness? Witness? Witness, since he has proven to be an unreliable witness. This is my question every single time we play this game, honestly. I'm just like, how is it that we can trust this person? They've lied to us freaking tens of times. Ev, get to work. <laughs> Ev, you, you got this. I believe in you. And that's comedy. <laughs> Now that's comedy. <laughs> immediately, as in, as in immediately. I am. I mean, sure, a minute might have elapsed before I did, but that's the duty of every good citizen. Or did they not teach that at your pitiful school? You say people learn about how to call the police in college? In college? In college? Hey, Nick, I think you should take a look at the court record for a sec. I will. I will check it. I just checked it too early, apparently. Isn't that the court record? How come I can't check it? I don't want to present it. I want to check it. I want to check it. Uh, it must have been 645 when I made the call. What? Excuse me? Dude, you're a lying sack of garbage. Points at you. He <laughs> duty. <laughs> colleague, colleague. There is no such thing as a reliable witness in the series. They are just used to it. <laughs> it just happens. I never learned to call the police. Wait, you never... I mean, I understand they said college, but you never learned to call the police, period? I feel like that's like the first thing they tell you when you're a kid. Hey, call 911. If uh, the police... You need to get a hold of the police. Uh, Mr. Wellington, could you please take a look at this? You mean the victim's autopsy report? According to this, the murder occurred at 6.28 p.m. So, what of it? You said that you called the police immediately after the murder took place. However, by the time you had called the police, it was already 6.45 p.m. There is clearly a 15-minute gap here. Do you deny it? Oh my god, Ev, you did not have to put them all in three separate clips. <laughs> I gotta just put them all together. <laughs> I think I did them all 30 seconds apart, too. I think this court would like to hear that what you were doing during this 15 minute gap. Mm. 
Enjoy the free puzzle game. <laughs> what have I done? <laughs> Look what you've done. You did this. Let Misty down. Oh, it's so hot. Doing the Lord's work. <laughs> I need to sit differently because my I'm sweaty. I'm just I'm just a, a, a sweaty guy. The witness was in or the witness was in shock at the time after witnessing a terrible murder. It's only to be expected that he would be a little dazed. Fifteen minutes is hardly what I would call a little dazed. <laughs> Mr. Wellington. Yes? Explain yourself. What were you doing during those fifteen minutes? Answer the question. Meow. Meow. I, uh, telephone. Uh, I mean, yeah, sir, yeah, you mean, yeah. Spit it out. I- I was searching for a phone booth! A phone booth? You mean, you don't have a cell phone? You're so rich, though. Why don't you have a cell phone, sir? Mm -hmm. How dare you? How could you, a rich man, intellectual man as yourself, use a scummy payphone for commoners? Wrong. Go to jail with you. You and your questions. As if you're trying to open all the layers of Matryoshka doll. Another? How many points do you have, Kim? Oh my goodness. Another one? Ara ara nya. Here. Ara ara nya. I don't like it. A few? <laughs> A few? Dang, yeah, you got... You got the... You got the... The the points to uh, I can't just think what I'm trying to say. I can't. <laughs> you got the bills to pay. The bills to pay. Wait, the bills. The bills. The bills. That was a good one. Yarvalode. <laughs> also, Zen, welcome in. You could say Mr. Wellington is done for. Well done. And that's probably not a rare event given the medium amounts of loser energy he admits. <laughs> Just a few million. Nothing too big. Yeah, nothing too bad. I don't know. <laughs> I wonder- wait. Do you remember when I kept doing the deep voice? You remember that? Like when I would do like this? Like I would do like the super deep voice? I don't remember what that sounded like as an ara ara, but I kind of want to just do it just because. Ara ara. Now I need to see it sound different. I need to see- both of them side by side, okay? Because I think I said that last time and I completely forgot. Um. Okay? I need to see them side by side. I gave you fries a free RR because I want to see it. I want to see how different it is because I don't remember. <laughs> I can't hear it myself. I can tell my voice is a little deeper when I do that. But like, I want actually, I want to hear it. Oh. <laughs> you must think you're really something special. I'm so special. <laughs> I'm, I'm special. Witness. Nia, I look <laughs> I do. <laughs> I, I, I lost my phone. There, are you happy? You lost it? Witness me. Look at me. Is that a pun of Beef Wellington? Yes. He is well done. I'm, I'm glad that, uh, you guys have said that, like, he's well done, uh, it's just like, oh, wait, yeah, you're right. He, that's, I think that's supposed to be, like, the joke, because he's like, you know, he's captured, he's, you know, gonna lose. He's well done. Overcooked, you may say. <laughs> Thank you for the love. Rooka meets the bone today. <laughs> he... You knew the job when you signed up. <laughs> this is true. Steak tartare and my um aren'ts think I'm nuts. Oh, steak tartare. Is that like like really ground up? Like, is it raw steak? I forget. A 
Unbelievable. You lose your glasses and your cell phone? Unbelievable. So much love, Aunt Harris. Thank you. You must be very scatterbrained when it comes to your belongings. I love steak tartare. I've never had steak tartare. What? Are you saying that first-rate people are never allowed to lose things? Ground on these dots. <laughs> I don't think... Oh, I didn't get to read it. With raw egg yolk? Oh, man, I'd be so scared to eat it. Like, raw meat and egg yolk? How does it taste? Is it, like, really irony? Is the egg kind of, like, bounds out the, um... The irony taste? Steak tartare, basically rare and very... Very seasoned? I see. I fear nothing. <laughs> I will eat a head off this fish. <laughs> Every time I think of Yiddy now, it's gonna be like I'm being able to just like rip the head off a fish with your bare teeth. No, oh, it's so funny to me. To be fair, Mr. Steak would be a great at arguing on Twitter. <laughs> Mr. Steak, sushi steak, just not chicken. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, it's like with steak. I don't know. I'm scared of like ground up steak. Because, like, that can get all kinds of bacteria in it and stuff like that. But, if it's, like, um, like a steak, like a steak steak, and you, you know, grill the edges, and you just cut, like, cut around the edges and eat the inside, you can literally eat the steak raw. Like, it'd be fine. <laughs> as long as you cook all the things around it off, you're good. That way it's not, like, all gross and stuff. Mr. Steak? And see her in the first place, or <laughs> Mr. Steak. <laughs> oh, now we're just gonna call Mr. Steak all the time. Yeah, chicken is no good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Raw chicken, but uh, don't eat raw chicken. Steak good though. Steak good. Oh man, oh man. Wait, hold on a second. He lost his cell phone. Nick, that cell phone. Could it be? You mean this phone Maggie found? There's no way. Boy, I didn't see this coming. What should I do now? Question further, of course. I'm so smart. So smart. You're so smart. Ground beef just needs to be cooked well done, though, right? Ground, yeah, ground beef. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because, like, when you, like, cut it up all like that, um, it, it, that is just, like, you know, introducing a bunch of, like, bacteria. I'm pretty sure, right? I also don't want to be wrong. My, my... <laughs> My, my Papa Tora was a meat inspector and it taught me all the things of meat! <laughs> ground beef, Mr. Wellington. Can we ground Mr. Wellington? Also, Buck, hi, welcome in. I hope you're having a good day. Mr. Wellington, where is your cell phone right now? I read it a few ways. Run a bit lighter under it. Or a big lighter under it, and it bring it to me. <laughs> Man, I think I remember getting a steak that was like, like it was a little raw inside, um, and I was like, "No, send it back! I cannot eat this! I want! I refuse!" Because I don't like the texture of it. Actually, I probably wouldn't like tartar if that's the case. If it, if it has that same texture, um. I got a spinach ricotta roll from a cafe just... <gasps> Give... It was cold. No! Uh-huh. If the quality control is good enough, you can even eat raw minced pork. In fact, under the name Met, it is very popular in Germany. Oh! Interesting. Meat from the ground? <laughs> Crazy. <laughs> and those are peanuts. <laughs> Oh, uh, because the protein. Mm, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Those are grubs. <laughs> it is a good restaurant. Rare is fine. Mm -hmm. Yeah, really good restaurant for sure, for sure. <laughs> what are you getting all excited about? You seem to be a little confused. I found my phone. I'll have you. Oh. <gasps> Please tell me he took my phone and I have his phone. Please, please, please tell me this is what happened. I found my phone. I have you know. See, here it is. Oh, 
Mm, I see. Damn it, I don't have his phone, do I? Hmm. Looks like he's got his phone. And I thought that just maybe this was his. <gasps> Wait, we do have it! <gasps> <laughs> You're telling me a ground met this beef? Met the beef? Well then, I think we've cleared this issue up. At the time of the murder, the witness did not have his cell phone because he had lost it. Rub a dub, thanks for the grub. I'll start eating worms. No! I mean, worms are like really good in protein, right? Like grubs. Like grubs are supposed to be like super, super good for you. But then you're like, oh, it's a bug, it's a bug, it's a bug! <laughs> what do you call a cow with no legs? Ground beef. I knew that one. <laughs> what do you call a cow with legs? A cow! <laughs> there we go. <laughs> <They're po> <laughs> the delay in his call was caused by a search for a phone booth. Are you telling me this cow is not common? No common cow. A joke was amusing. <laughs> well, that's the gist of it. I guess you could put it that way and leave it at that. Do you have any further questions, Mr. Wright? There is something. Your Honor, the witness's testimony does not make any sense. I don't believe that there was ever a need for the witness to search for a phone. How dare you! Stop! Get out of here! Get- Pushes you out of the room. Get out of here. Go away. I have one million power with my legendary dairy cow. Legendary cow? <laughs> oh, get off the stage! Moo! What do you call a cow with two legs? I don't know. Why are you asking me questions? <laughs> oh! Are you gonna milk that joke? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> you can't just make outrageous claims like that! You do have some sort of proof, don't you? Well, yeah, of course. This evidence should be good enough, I think. Alright, let's have the proof then. Please present proof that the witness had no need to search for a public phone booth. Please. You're freaking get out of here. Think of the hydrate crab. Consume water. I'm not even gonna read that last part of that sentence. <laughs> it's very simple. This is the evidence that backs up my claim. And yet again, you have presented the court, this court, with an obtuse, meaningless item. Huh? It's obtuse and meaningless? I don't get you at all, Nick. Why do you think we wouldn't need to look for a phone in the first place? Well, that's because I was looking at the evidence and it just hit me. I thought, hey, he really didn't have to look for a phone. Then why didn't you hurry up and present that piece of evidence? I'm saving. Thank you for the save, Gav. Thank you. <laughs> And now that that was the piece of evidence again. I thought it would be your phone, but your power are we not? List of con artists and their phone numbers. Oops, I keep pressing the R button to present things, and that's not correct. It's very simple. This is the evidence that backs up my claim. I'm gonna scream. <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm gonna scream. I'm gonna scream. I. Mmm. None of the area around the victim's hand. I was hoping there would be a phone or something. Wait, the phone was right there. <laughs> I didn't even notice. <laughs> oh, sir. 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 It's funny because I believed him for a second. And I'm like, oh yeah, yeah, the phone booth was pretty far, wasn't it? <laughs> I didn't even like it. Oh my god, I saw it too. I looked right at that phone booth like six times, like just staring at it. Because I was like, that's such a weird placement. <laughs> and then it just turns out, oh wait. Oh. 
You make the strangest noises. <laughs> I do. I make noises. I think I am artistic. <laughs> <laughs> it's quite simple, actually. Please take a look at this. Listen, phone booths are a mostly extinct species. There's no shame in not recognizing one. <laughs> but I know a phone booth! I know what a phone booth is! I got this! I believe in me! Believe in me that believes in you! Why is this game all cooperative again? <laughs> I just need a phone booth! Welcome to Spacey Tourist Channel. You must be new here. <laughs> phone booths aren't that old. They're, they're pretty. I mean, they're pretty old, right? How old are phone booths? When were they released? Hee <laughs> hee. I am autistic. It's such a thing to say. <laughs> At the crime scene photo. Is there a problem with it? Oh, there's nothing wrong with the picture. But if you don't understand my logic after looking at it, something is wrong with you. No! It's... it's a phone booth. That is correct. All the defendant had to do was walk three steps. <laughs> Pulls out a rotary phone <laughs> just out of your pocket. Yeah, it fits in your pocket. What do you mean? <laughs> What's the problem? <laughs> they, in awe of my tism. <laughs> Mr. Wellington, why did you not use the phone that was right in front of you? Questions, questions, questions. Order, order! You shut up! What does reporting the crime a little late prove for the defense? <laughs> Dude. <laughs> The witness can't explain what he was doing for those 15 minutes. That is reason enough that there's suspicion on his testimony. Yes, this is very true. What do you have to say for yourself, witness? Then I bet this phone really is his, Nick. He must have killed Dustin to get his phone back. But Maggie said she was going to return it to him. So there was no reason for him to kill for it. And on top of that, we still have the phone she found anyway. Hmm. Are we sure it's a his phone and not our phone? What phone does he have? I'm pretty sure he has our phone, though. Nyoku, welcome in. I hope you're having a good day. And I hope you had a good weekend. He too didn't know what a phone booth was either. <laughs> uh, what's the most crazy phone? A rotary phone probably is the craziest phone. But I was like, I needed to find a rotary phone. Do you even know what a rotary phone is? Yes. I do. Shut up. <laughs> hmm. But if he wasn't looking for a cell phone, maybe he was looking for something else. Maybe he's looking for the glove. No, but then he would have taken the glove. I don't know. Was he... Mr. Wright? Yes, Your Honor. Do you have any thoughts you would like to share with the court? Can you offer an explanation as to what the witness was doing during those 15 minutes? I'm gonna save... Cause I don't know what the heck he was doing. He was probably looking through his phone or something. Or wait, I know his phone. Fuck. No, wait. Yes, I have an idea. Let's see what happens. Look at bullshit or went through this. Rotary phones were so fun. Rip, uh, pulse style. I forget. Rotaries are the ones you spin, right? You spin. You put your finger in the hole and then you like woo. Right. I think I remember saying like a couple weeks ago that I used to play with my dads all the time. And I, <laughs> I just stick my finger and I go, wee, wee, and that's all I would do for like an hour. <laughs> there is only one possible explanation. They're literally called rotary. I'm just saying, I just want to make sure I have the right thing. Because <laughs> they spin. Maybe, maybe, maybe a rotary phone could have also been like, you spin, you get a, a, a wire and you just spin your phone around. That's how you charge it. I don't know. <laughs> I just think of the dumbest reasons. <laughs> Alright, let's hear your explanation. However, be forewarned that if your explanation is not persuasive, you will be penalized. Think carefully before you present, Mr. Wright. The spin! I now have a wonderful image in my head of Tora just spinning wildly around a phone. Yes! <laughs> You know those cord phones people used to have in their houses? Tor Christ, Tora, you're unreasonably funny. What? Me? 
Hello me. Hello <laughs> me. Yes, Your Honor. Ugh, I probably shouldn't have said there was only one possibility. Please present to the court the one piece of evidence that will answer the following. Why didn't the witness call the police right away? His glasses, probably. <laughs> they have <laughs> Oh, I think it's, um, his glasses, though, right? <laughs> Miss Turf Steak! What? Don't do that! You almost gave me a heart attack! Good! I'm just complimenting. I accept your compliment. It makes me so awesome. <laughs> Mr. Well Done. Shot, welcome in. These are your glasses, aren't they? Uh, where... Where did you find... Every <laughs> time he strangles himself. <laughs> oh my god. I believe the court all heard what you just confessed to. That these glasses are in fact yours. Listen, I'll accept any compliments, and you can leave them at my doorstep, and I will accept them wholeheartedly, and I'll just be like, Give it to me. Give it to me. That's a link. On a mod. Be that guy. Oh, the, the, the period. The period makes it a link. I can't believe Automod didn't get it. Which I'm glad it didn't. Let me be... I'll, <laughs> I'll be honest. I'm really glad um, Automod's been a little better at the link thing. But still. Oh my gosh. I'll tell you where they were... Uh, i tell you where they were found, Mr. Steak. These glasses were found under the victim's body. You're welcome. <laughs> uh, occasionally it likes to gobble a message. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sometimes it's just weird. I don't know why. Under the victim's body? Under the body! God, Tora, you're so marketable. <laughs> marketable? <laughs> we could make so many plushies of you! Slaps. Slaps me. You could fit so many! <laughs> well, I don't know what to... You could fit in me. You could fit so many cakes in this! Tiger? I don't know. See, I'm nicer than that. Order, order! <laughs> you stole my joke, Tora, damn it. <laughs> I still remember the time Automon gave me for writing Diva the one time, yeah. <laughs> we can fit so many marketable plushies in this bad boy. <laughs> Dude, I want plushies so bad. It kills me. I wanted it. Oh. Uh, eight ball. Are we chill? It's silently so. Hey, Gavin and eight ball have uh set aside their differences and are friends now. <laughs> no, wait a second. Hold on. I can't confess or confirm anything. Eight ball chat. Is this real? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Are you lying, 8-Ball? Most likely. <laughs> I don't know, 8-Ball, I don't know what you're trying to tell me anymore. Your Honor, I think the answer is quite clear here. As he fell, Dustin Prince grabbed the culprit's glasses. The culprit knew that he had to find his glasses and search frantically for them. What he didn't realize was that they were under the victim's body. And that is why it took you 15 minutes to call- make that call. Eight ball. Is chat just one guy with a hundred accounts? Yeah! Oh, oh. Chat. W well, I didn't... Hmm. <laughs> you heard the ball. <laughs> Man, Gav, Ev, and Terrace, Kim? Everyone's the same person? What? That's wild. Do you guys have like a hundred phones? Or do you, do you, do you guy? Do, does one guy have a hundred phones? You current? <laughs> We're all you. It's true, Tora. We're all the same person. Wait, wake up. Oh, oh. Guys, I had the strangest dream. I, I, I dreamt that I was a VTuber. Wait a minute! <laughs> <laughs> what the f 
I'm in a dream. I'm in a dream. Wake up. We'll wake up. <laughs> I'm in a never ending nightmare. I'm just one guy with all these accounts. I'm chatting currently. This is why it's a just chatting stream. That's why everyone's just like chatting all the time. It's because it's like I'm just currently like typing on all my phones. You said that you said there was so much anger. <laughs> the voices. <laughs> nightmare, nightmare, nightmare. Hi, <laughs> Dora, it's me. Your only follower. For months, I've been giving you the illusion that you had multiple followers. And now to prove this, I will send the same message on my other accounts. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> it's true. I'm also Dora. Oh, no. This is the worst time I've <laughs> Dora, have you played Vampire the Masquerade? I have not. I've heard about it, but I have not played it. Oh god! They're all me! Whoa! They're all the one follower. The one follower is me. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh, this is so good. <laughs> Thank you guys. <laughs> I mean, thank you. Thank you, guy. Singular. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, you haven't played Vampire the Masquerade? No. I only got a computer recently, like the past like year and a half or so. Um, So I've been playing many games. Games. I'm not real. I'm merely a fragment of your overactive imagination. But hey, thanks for thinking of me. Anytime. <laughs> Don't take Tora for uh, Malkavian. It's Malkavian. Uh, oh boy. I leave to go put up laundry, come back to this chaos. I'm getting my mallet. No! You can't, you can't destroy my one follower. That, that, that means everyone will go away. <laughs> you want to see the gayest vamp? Do it. This is the worst dream I've had in ages. <laughs> oh, I appreciate you guys. <laughs> Mr. Wright, are you... Are you indicating the witness as the real murderer? To be fair, the voices are usually right. You mean Guy? I love you, Guy. <laughs> oh, this music. I love this. By the way, I'm taking over the stream. It's mine now. No! I'm not even in control anymore! No! Of course, that is precisely what I am doing. And the one guy loves you too. <laughs> uh, BTM is like insanely by gay. Oh! You say the magic words. I know I'm right. He is the real murderer. Did you figure it out, Nick? More or less. Turns out the cell phone was the key to this case after all. Anyway, now's your chance to deep six this. Deep six? Deep six? What does that mean? What is deep six? We're gonna rainbow six siege this guy. Unalive? Really? That's what that means? I'll sink him out in one shot. <gasps> Wait. Deep six. Oh, man, if you had D6 or something, I'd be like, a it was a battleship? <laughs> Never heard of it. I get it. Like, six feet under. Oh, Rainbow Six Siege. Let's go. <laughs> yeah, I'm playing Rainbow Six Siege a little bit. I'm getting better at it. Slowly. I'll sink him in one shot. Yeah. This is so exciting, watching you work again. Somehow, my old self is coming back to me. Wait, is this like... Did Maya come back for like the first time today, pretty much? Because she's saying seeing you work again, like she hasn't seen it. Siege. See. Ash, my beloved. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I like... Who do I like? Verm, girl, come back! I don't know who I like! Um, I like... A shield guy. It's been a bit since I played. It's been like a couple weeks, so I forgot. Um... 
Oh, I like the one person who throws bombs. Blitz. Blitz is the shield guy. Yeah, 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 yeah. What's the person who throws... I think their name starts with an E. Um, but they throw little mines that look like... Like cement. Ella? Ella, 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 Ella. Yeah, I like her. Those are the two I like playing as. They're fun. It's time to sink or swim. Everything rests on the edge of a knife. This is the moment I've been waiting for. Also, Yinny, thank you. <laughs> and Kim as well, thank you for <laughs> letting me know the names. I was totally blanking. This is the moment I've been waiting for. I haven't played Rainbow Six Siege in many years. So I have no idea who I played as anymore. Mm. There's probably a lot of guys. Or many more units to be too since you've played. Order! Order! <laughs> Your Honor, this def defense! The defense is making a mockery of this court! Without any solid ground to stand on! He accused the witness of being the murderer! Y yeah, that that's right! I'm no criminal! Uh, this is the great fraud of a lawyer! In that case, why don't we look at it from a different perspective? Let's hear your explanation as to why you are not the murderer. Why? That's that's easy. Um. Uh. For example, that I I I I didn't do it. Easy. I didn't do it. I, case solved. <laughs> for example, that's um the name of the victim wrote. What about that? Oh, you mean the name Maggie? Yeah. Even an idiot like you can read that, right? But we already know this was not written by the victim himself. After all, the defendant's name is Maggie, and the victim was left-handed. I can't believe they don't say Maggie with a Y or something, because, like, can they see the text boxes? Like, we said this earlier, it's like, like, you can't see the text. In other words, in order to make the defendant look guilty, the real criminal used the victim's right hand to write her name on the ground. But, 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 wouldn't that mean that the real criminal was someone the defendant knew? Otherwise, how else would that person know her name was Maggie, or Maggie? That is a good point. The witness didn't even know of Miss Bird's before, or Miss Bird before this trial. Ah, I forgot. Hmm. Was there any way this creep could have known Maggie's name beforehand? There was a way. It would be best if I could prove that the witness had a chance to learn. That the defendant's name was Maggie. Yeah, he's the one that called on the phone. Now, will the defense please present its case? How would the witness have known the defendant's name? Uh, it should be this one. Mr. S Mr. Rare. I'm just gonna call him a different stake name every single time. You didn't have your cell phone with you on the day of the murder, correct? Oh, what if I didn't? Oh, now you're out there smug. Also, what's the Brazilian girl who has stealth? I do not know. I don't have all the characters unlocked either, but the knife? Hmm. Hmm. When you realized you had l lost it, what did you do? Kavera? Oh, wow. Man, you guys are on top of things. What did I do? What did I do? Didn't you try to find it by calling it? Why, you... How did you... Your honor! These questions have nothing to do with... Overruled. Mr. Wright, where are you going with this line of questioning? Only name in Portuguese? Oh, interesting. Do you think there is some relation between the witness's cell phone and the murder? I do, Your Honor. On the day of the murder, Maggie Bird picked... I keep going to say bride. Uh, Maggie Bird picked up a lost phone in the park. And... She also received a phone call from the owner of the, po of the phone. Almost the police. <laughs> Means skull, if you're curious. Ooh, interesting. I guess that's why they have a face painting of a skull on their face, right? I'm assuming it's the same person, right? Um, hello? Oh, thank you. I've been searching for my phone. Is this yours? Oh, I'm glad you called. We can meet up and I can give this back. I'll be right there. Um, I'm sorry. I didn't catch your name. You can call me Maggie. Blue Badger. 
Yeah, I think she's cool. She's kind of neat. That was when you learned that her name was Maggie. Uh, um, uh... But you made one fatal mistake. Fatal mistake? My client's name is Maggie, but the name that was written on the ground was Maggie. Clear difference. Maggie, 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 Maggie. This is a mistake that could only occur if all you know, all you knew was... Let me redo that. This is a mistake that could only occur if all you knew was how her name sounded. <laughs> you blew badger. The real culprit. Did she have a Hello Kitty shirt? Boo Badger! Boo Badger! Order! Order! But your honor! The witness has no motive! And your point is? It's very simple, your honor. A person usually would not kill someone without a reason. Mr. Wellington had no reason to kill anyone. That's absolutely correct. I don't have a motive! Hmm. Mr. Wright. Your honor? Can you explain what motive this witness could have had? It's very simple, Your Honor. You sure, Nick? If I said I can't offer an explanation, then the trial is over, right? Yeah, but... Oh, to be one of those people with a commonly misspelled name. Couldn't imagine what it's like. I mean... It's probably a good thing that you don't have a uh, commonly misspelled name. Unless you don't want to be charged for murder. <laughs> Bullshitting your way through a trial. That's the Phoenix way. Let's go. What am I doing? He had a motive. It's the... Ah, burping. 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 Uh, it's a list of con artists. Mr. Well Done's motive is right here. What is this? A list? These phone numbers were pulled from the memory of the phone the defendant found. You could accidentally be called a different name that's different from the original name. True. Also, hey. Hello! Hello, Maniac. Welcome in. I hope you're having a good day. Also, day. Also, welcome in. Hope you're also having a good day. To our space attorney. Let's go! Attorneys in space! It's me. And we have determined that the people on this list are members of a certain group. You. You looked up all those numbers? Oh, so you admit it. Of course. His list of phone numbers was stored in the cell phone's memory. The names and numbers belong to people who are members of a certain con artist group. <laughs> what? Con artist? <laughs> yes, con artist. Hey, Spacey. Hello, how was your work day, day? Day, 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 day. Can you explain why these numbers were on your phone, Mr. Well Done? This... this is an outrage! An invasion of privacy! Looking at the phone numbers on a person's phone is a worse crime than murder! Wait, what are you trying to say? Are you trying to put me in prison instead of you? Because you are the murderer? You are the one of those people! There's like those cops who raid their... <gasps> The numbers, Mason. I don't care, Mr. Rare. All I want is for you to tell us what this list is about. This isn't America. You have no Fourth Amendment rights here. You, you think you, any of you, know what it's like to be a refined man such as me? Your Honor, this, this is, this is unjustified. Badgering of the witness. Objection overruled. Mr. Wright, what is the meaning of this? Why would the witness have the number of group of con artists on his phone? Isn't that obvious? The witness is... Looking into the group? A member of the group? Let's save. Because I feel like two of these answers can be very similar. A member of the group and the... I've been here, just lurking while grinding in Dark Souls. How's Dark Souls going? Safe scum, easy! A member of that group. Mr. Wait, what's another stake? What's another stake? I only know... Rare, well done. 
Oh, I mm, almost said over easy, but then I'm like, that's an egg. <laughs> Blue? Oh, gosh. Medium, medium, thank you. I was like, what is the one I get all the time? Me, I get medium rare. Mr. Medium Rare is a member of this very group. <laughs> Burnt. No, egg mentioned. Big. Big. Big, 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 big. The witness is a banana. Banana. Poorly. No. I wish you had the luck in Dark Souls. What do the numbers mean? Egg. Egg. Everyone who has tier 3 or tier 2, can we get a spam of uh, bald species? <laughs> no! All of your friends' phone numbers are short stored right here on this phone. Got you covered. <laughs> spam the bald bulge! If anyone were to look into these phone numbers, it would be all over for you. We've got your Discord server on luck, Banana Boy! Banana Man. This is why you had to kill. No! This is too much! You mean... The right amount. The, the right amount of heat, you could say. <laughs> hmm, that does make quite a bit of sense. Well, Mr... Wait, what did I say? <laughs> Mr. Medium. <laughs> Would you care to explain? I, um, I... I got you now. I, I, that, I, that police officer! Can you stop it? <laughs> Can you please back away? He is pretty much admitted to it at this point. You just need to step away. Don't talk to me ever again. Do not come into the third game and I don't want to see you ever again. 1-800. <laughs> Your Honor. What is it, Mr. Payne? Your Honor, this... This is... This is unjustified badgering of the witness! You said that already. He is cooked now. <laughs> he is so well done. So burned. It's over, Wellington. We know all your favorite Discord stickers. <gasps> it's all the cutesy ones. You said the exact same thing only a few seconds ago. <laughs> Please! Please, let me think about the content of that, or think about the content of that phone call. That's Bed Bath & Beyond. Are Bed Bath & Beyonds even still around, though? I feel like they went all out of business, or maybe not all of them did, but some of them did. Jay! All rise for the Honorable Judge Tora. Hmm. Yes. All rise? Jay, how are you doing? They go for the tier one for nine months. And on your seven month streak, let's go. Hell yeah. Thank you so much, Jay. I appreciate it. Many of them are going bankrupt. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. Blue rare, medium rare, medium, medium well. Well done. There's all the steak temperatures. So many and burnt. Um, hello? Oh, thank you. I've been searching for my phone. Is this yours? Oh, I'm glad you called. We can meet up and I can give this back. The defendant had already promised that she would return the phone. After that, all Mr. Wellington had to do was meet Miss Bird to get his phone back. Why then would he need to kill anyone? Maniac, thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. Strap, welcome in. Oh, is Ace Attorney going? It's going good! We're at the end of the first case already. I mean, it did take us like probably longer than it should have, but we did it. Objection, Your Honor. I can't recall what's going on. I was too busy thinking about someone wearing red. <laughs> I don't fully remember who they are, but I remember he looked handsome, and I wanted to see if his lips were really as soft as they looked. I think his name was... Kilometers? <laughs> I thought I was gonna go with Edgeworth. <laughs> His name is Edgeworth, and I want to kiss him. <laughs> hmm. That is a valid point. What does the defense think about this? Hmm. If you think about it logically, then it makes sense. Then maybe we should be thinking outside the box. Yeah. If we think like that, let's see. Christ, even. <laughs> Cursed. <laughs> I just want Phoenix Wright to be with his boyfriend. Miles Edgeworth, and they can be together forever. 
Think outside the bun. The bun. Think outside the steak. Maybe that slime ball saw something at the crime scene that made him commit murder. Your thoughts, Mr. Wright? Hmm, well... I don't think Mr. Wellington went to pick up his phone in a very friendly manner. But he was promised his phone, so why would he have been unfriendly to the defendant? I think he must have been something that didn't agree with him when he got there. Tinkle outside the binkle. <laughs> Thank you for the save. Buckle, buckle. Buckle, buckle. Well then, Mr. Wright. What was this something that didn't agree with the witness? The bananas! Was it actually the bananas? Was it the bananas? I don't think anything else would have been disagreeable. Also, how did, did he push him off? Did Bird not see this happen? Like, if this guy pushed him off the wall and Bird, what did, what did Bird do that entire time? Um, or did he just come over to him and snap his neck and then run away? Like, what? <laughs> uh, business card. Hand wrote my number on the back with the con artist and their phone number stored on my phone. You can present profiles. You're so right. Is it because he's a policeman? He was gonna get caught? That's my only guess. I don't remember who she is. But I get the feeling I know her. <laughs> I think it's because... Because she wasn't dressed like a policeman. He was. So I'm wondering if that, like, you know, set him off or something like that. That's possible. I think I'll do it. We did save. I didn't mean to percent. Thank you for reminding me of profiles, by the way. I totally forgot about that. What Mr. Wellington saw was the victim. The, uh, the victim? You mean Dustin Prince? <laughs> I keep wanting to say rest in peace. <laughs> uh, Rustin. Rusty peace. <laughs> Rusty peas. Dustin Prince had gone on his date right after his shift was over. With no time to change, he went to the park, still wearing his police uniform. Oh! The girl that picked up my phone is with the policeman. He couldn't have known they were going out, so he began to worry. He was afraid the policeman would ask a few questions before returning the phone. If I do anything suspicious, he might run a check on my phone. In his mind, it was possible they had already run a check on the phone. And he went into panic. Is that... Is what you're saying? Guilty. Bayless! Don't smack his nuts! Yamba, yeah, welcome in. Hope you're doing well. Um... What price say about... Next app? <laughs> Send him to the principal's office and have him expelled. <gasps> no! Not... Not. Rusty peas. <laughs> yeah, rusty peas. <laughs> Kivalubu, welcome in. Hope you're having a good day. Exactly. Officer Prince was murdered simply because he was in uniform. Bump, bump. Rusty what now? I was trying to think of his name like he's rest in peace. Like, how do I make his name a pun? Yet. Yet, 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 yet. Yeah, I was like, I'm like, how can I make his name rust rest in peace? I was like, rust e peas. <laughs> no, it doesn't make any sense at all, but we got there. Also, rusted, hi. <laughs> rusty, <laughs> rusty branch. <laughs> You know those shredders that can tear up cars? Chuck them in there and make them pay per view. Oh no! No! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Mr. Payne, do you have any comments? I, um, I'm thinking. Mm, it seems the truth has come out at last. Rusty's. Mmm, guys, have you ever heard about the 
hit film cars cars two cars three um planes and all the other cars franchise movies and tv shows rusties can get rid of that rust for you with one little wipe of our rusty brand <laughs> I can get any of your rusty bumpers in a matter of seconds. Rusty's sponsor me. <laughs> not the real company. It's like not even a real company. Sponsor me. <laughs> Rusty's nuts. No! I found you on YouTube two days ago and already binged all of Metroid Fusion in the first Jack 2 episodes. Oh! I'm on the way train for episode 3. Oh, I appreciate it. I unfortunately can't play Jack and Daxter at the moment. Um, because one of the cords that I have for the PS3 doesn't work anymore. I'm hoping I can get a new one. Um, um, but, you know, exclamation point throne. Thank you, Eb. Um, there, I did put it on throne as well. Um, but for now, Jack and Dexter's took a little bit of a shelf life until I can figure out how to get that to work again, because it was dying. Uh, because, like, last, well, last week I meant to play Jack and Daxter and it wasn't working. And I had to play Splatoon instead, unfortunately. But... I appreciate it. Hopefully we can play Jack and Daxter. Um soon. <laughs> but also I appreciate um Vinny through Fusion. I do want to play Zero Mission soon-ish. I do want to. I like Fusion a lot, and I really want to get to the other Metroid games as well. And maybe even play like um What's the game? Uh blah 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 blah. I was just talking about it yesterday, actually. Uh blah 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 blah. Um, Metroid Dread. I want to play Metroid Dread again. I love that game. Metroid Dread is amazing. Thank you for liking my YouTube channel as well. If you guys haven't haven't seen or don't know, I have a YouTube channel as well. I post all my VODs and some clips on there as well. And maybe some highlights every so often. Thank you, Ab. Thank you for linking socials as well. Thank you, thank you. But yeah, I'm glad you uh, followed me through YouTube. And thank you for telling me that too. That really helps. Like, it really helps me. But also, very much welcome in. Welcome, welcome. It's good to see you. Uh, the witness, Mr. Wellington. You are... <laughs> oh god, there he comes. Oh god, what is the joke? He's eating the fish. <laughs> Impressive. Not bad for a person with a third-rate education. What's that supposed to mean? <laughs> the evidence. Evidence! Ugh, that guy was really creeping me out. Yeah, that face? Yeah. All you've been waving around and talking about is that suspicious cell phone. Thank you for liking Kofi as well. If you guys want to donate to Kofi, uh... Funds go directly to me and support the stream as well. I... Guys, I really want to make a model. I, I don't, Actually, I wouldn't make the model. Uh, I'm not going to make this like a huge thing or anything like that either, but I want to talk about it a little bit because I got excited over it. Um, I saw somebody. <gasps> Metroid Daxter Tilda sent by a throne dot com. Sigourney Weaver. <laughs> Thank you for the cord, by the way. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to test it as soon as I get it. By the way, like I really wanna, I really wanna play Jack and Daxter. You have no idea. Like appreciate that so much. It really helps. Like, <sighs> thank you. Um. Cord get, <laughs> cord get. We're gonna really, we're, and if it's not the issue, if that's not the reason why it doesn't work, I'm not sure why. But I really do want to test everything. Um. Yeah, 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 yeah. We'll, we'll, we'll figure this out. No, and, and if it doesn't work still, um, well, we might think of like other means to try to get Jack and Dexter, and at least Jack and Dexter. Um. But if it doesn't work, man, man, <laughs> maybe I can also try to get like if if it also doesn't work, try to just get another year membership for uh, PlayStation Plus and just play it on the PS5. <laughs> there are ways. There are ways. Cord, give me out. Thank you so much. That really means a lot. Thank you. I, I, I'm gonna try. Like I said, just try my best to make it work. Bro, about to say, cause you be on that phone. You on that phone though. No. Any games on your phone? Corner has a YouTube? Yes, I actually I also have a Discord as well. <laughs> You're welcome. Thank you, Kim. 
Thank you. We have technology. We could fix him. We could fix him. Oh. Ma'am. Oh, what I was gonna say was, um, I really want to make a model that's based off of this. Yep. My tiger model. Um, I really want to make a 3D model of him. Really, 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 really bad. Um, but I don't know anything about 3D modeling and I have to pay for somebody to do that. And I also want to redesign him as well a little bit. Um, so I think that any, like, money that goes towards stream, um, is gonna go towards that a little bit. Um, because I'm not gonna dip into, like, I'm already, like, saving the money that we earned from, like, uh, that one subathon um, that we did to fund for the live 2D. I'm still, I still have that, and uh, that's not getting touched. <laughs> that is not. <laughs> that is saved in safekeeping. It's never been touched into live 2D. I better get on that Discord and enjoy hanging out with all the wonderful people in chat. I bet it's a great way to stay up to date on what Tor is streaming too. Yeah, and I behind the scenes things that I'm doing. <laughs> And if you're subscribed, you have a special channel, um, just, just for subscribers. And I post some things in there that I don't post anywhere else, and you can see them for yourself. You just have to connect your, uh, Discord to your, uh, your Twitch, and you're good to go! Gab, you have been there for like a year. What do you mean, Gab? Gab is so excited to be joining the Discord. Oh, I better subscribe so I can enjoy the benefits. <laughs> hey guys, if you subscribe at tier three, <laughs> I do a little headshot drawing of you, uh, just for subscribing for tier three because it helps benefit towards me, uh, towards the uh, 60-40 split. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, I'm done shilling. <laughs> Finally, a channel I can ignore. <laughs> no. Don't ignore. Um, man, I wish I was in the Discord. Wow. <laughs> Gee, I should really check out that Discord. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Oh, my God. Man. I, I, man, I started being soft. I'm lucky. Thank you, guys. Thank you guys for being such a person good community. It means a lot. I care for you guys. Suspicious phone number, this. Suspicious con group, that. They're all on that phone. But who's to say that phone is really Nina. mine? I love you too. Yes, yes, let's go. Where's your proof? Your evidence? Not to mention, you guys are like really excited about Ace Attorney, like I am. Uh, even if you're not excited about Ace Attorney, you're excited for me to talk between Ace Attorney lines. <laughs> and it'd just be a just chatting stream. <laughs> um, because I really love this game, and I'm glad you guys do too, and it makes me happy that you guys are happy. So it makes me really happy to stream this again. It was really good. <laughs> you want proof that this phone is yours? <laughs> I already told you earlier. That phone I lost, I've already found it. You don't have even the slightest idea who the phone in your hand belongs to. Okay, who's the contacts in your phone you got there? I love Tola. Aww. I also gotta go badge. Aww. Please, please get some sleep. Kim, okay, appreciate you. Thank you for sticking around. I hope you have an amazing sleep. I hope you have a good tomorrow as well. Hope you have a good night. Goodbye. Goodbye, goodbye. Uh, but you can be sure it isn't mine, you simpleton. What? <laughs> simpleton? <laughs> <laughs> it feels good to see you squirm. Like a worm. <laughs> we do seem to have a problem on our hands with this phone. Whose phone is it? Without knowing that, it's meaningless as evidence. Your Honor. This is bad. I can't let him turn the tables on me like this. Hmm. This cell phone. There has to be something I've overlooked. There's got to be. Hmm. Maybe. Fingerprints on the phone. No. Stored numbers. This phone has the names and numbers of those in the con group in its memory. I can show them to you, Your Honor. I don't believe.
believe this. What are you talking about? Hee hee, squirm like a worm. See <laughs> hee, squirm like a hee hee worm. <laughs> uh, what are you? Or what are we trying to determine? Is who, or what we are trying to determine is who that phone belongs to. He worms. He worms. What about his home phone number, though? His phone number. Who cares about what phone numbers are stored on it? Besides, who knows? Maybe you win and added some of those numbers in yourself. The witness is quite right. I'm afraid I have to reject the defense's proposal. Oh, that jerk is back to his arrogant, annoying self again. Hmm. This cell phone. There has to be something I've overlooked. There's got to be. Hmm. Maybe. Fingerprint, I guess. I got it! We should transfer fingerprints! Sorry, you want to hear something exciting I found yesterday if you're a fan of Kerbo? Yes! Tell me! Tell me what is about Kerbo! Fingerprints? Yes, your honor. Mr. Beef must have left some prints on this phone. Nick, don't you remember? When you got that from Maggie, you wiped it off! I- what? You said there was sand all over it, so... Wiped it. I wiped it? Pretty thoroughly, too. <laughs> no, then he goes back to rubble. Like, he's just a maniacal laugh. People managed to make Kirby air right online. So, Yamba. Yeah, I might have partaken in playing online Kirby air ride. Air, air, ride, air ride. Don't tell anybody. Shh. I, 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 you didn't hear that from me. Someone, someone I know has done that and has played with some others online. Yes. It's very funny. <laughs> it sucks because, you know, the people that this so-called person hmm, that played it played with someone or people who are across the world and the lag was kind of crazy so we had to make sure the buffering was good. <laughs> Honestly, anything on the phone would be smudged or likely partial prints. I know, right? I mean, like, the... I mean, maybe the buttons would have it, I guess. But... I don't know. I, it's hard, because, like, you're tapping a lot of buttons, and, you know, there's fingerprints all over the thing. Knock, knock, who's there? It's me! Hello! Nature, welcome in! Or do, would you rather be called Guyon? Welcome in, welcome in. Hope you're having a good day. Have you played online yet, Yamba, for career ride? I mean, wait, can you play with like other people, like random people? Tora, do you be like, do not read to me the ancient tomes. I was there when it was written. I actually just recently uh, started playing online, like older games online with friends and stuff. Um, like like literally the past like two weeks. Ugh. So it's been it's been it's been a good time. Um. I'm glad I can play these games online. Like Mario Party, for example. Like, you couldn't play these old Mario Parties online with people. And I'm finally able to, like, actually do that. And I do own these games, by the way. Like, I do actually own... Um... I own, like, every Mario Party. <laughs> I gotta get that figured out. I found out yesterday. Let's go! Yeah, get it, get it, get it! It's a really good time. Yes, I'm not guilty. Not guilty. Oh, it's oh so much fun watching third ray trash babble like morons amongst themselves. Ugh, he's made a complete recovery. How many times do I have to say this? My phone is right here, you see. Tell me your contacts. Oh, and incidentally, you can't check the numbers stored on this phone. Did you delete them all? It must have glitched because all the numbers just magically disappeared. You've got to be joking. He erased all the numbers I was going to use as evidence. Mr. Wellington. What's this? By the tone of your voice, it sounds like you still have some fight left in you. Where did you finally... Er, where did you finally find your cell phone? <laughs> <laughs> oh, you are too much! And of course you have no idea what I'm talking about! And tampering with evidence to, cha to the charges now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
You know, Spliff, you already know. She's playing for the first time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, this is Maggie Bird. Correct, correct. Yes, yes. This is the first trial. I, I, oh my, oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Now I remember. Oh, you got his memories back? <laughs> Looks like they hung up. Ah, good. I finally found it. See, I think, uh, yeah, he just called it. He just, yeah. Did he hit me with, a like an extinguisher? A fire extinguisher? So that's when. What's wrong, Mr. Attorney? Why the harsh glare in your eyes? Nick, we've worked so hard to get this far, but... If you don't do something quick, he's gonna get off scot-free. I know. I know this phone has to be his. But how am I supposed to prove something like that? Mr. Wright. If you cannot prove who the owner of that cell phone is... He just deleted all my contacts, I'm realizing. He deleted every single one of them. I'm kinda mad. <laughs> Your dictament has no bi or basis, and therefore, no power. It looks like you came up a penny short. Where? Where did I go wrong? I mean, getting knocked out by him. <laughs> Don't blame yourself. You're merely a third-rate lawyer. Third-rate lawyer. You only made one big mistake. Who are you? What are you? That's something you haven't figured out for yourself yet. Who I am? The court hereby concludes the cross-examination. <laughs> All of his sweet back-and-forth messages with Edgeworth. Gone! Yeah, how's he gonna contact Edgeworth now? He's lost his freaking boyfriend's freaking number! Nature... Oh, Nature Guy... Oh, I understand your name now! The, na the Nature Guy on YouTube, I understand! I'm so sorry. I am... So bad. <laughs> I was so bad at reading. Welcome in. Sorry, apologies for getting your name wrong there. If that will be all, I'll have to bid you gentlemen and ladies goodbye. I have a reservation at that ultra fancy restaurant on the upper side of town. Did you know? It was that nature guy. I need to. <laughs> Thank you for your assistance. You've had a stressful day, so please, bon appetit. Only house visits, then. Only house visits. Edgeworth is the guy who would only give out his office phone number anyway, so that would be easily to recover. True! Um, I mean, I guess I can save and raise an objection. Let's see. Where's an objection? Hold it. Hold it! Please wait, Your Honor. Okay. I don't know what to do. Ah! Thank you, God. Thank you for the bit. I appreciate it. Thank you for your itty bitty. Thank you. All right, Nick. I think I may be able to prove it. Prove it? Prove what, Mr. Wright? Everything. Your Honor! This cross examination has already ended! Besides, the defense is just going to badger the witness with more inane questions. I do that to people if I feel good? Oh, heck yeah. I'm glad you feel nice enough to give me a pity. You will not harass the witness. Is that clear, Mr. Wright? I'll harass him if I want to. He kind of deserves it. <laughs> Did you hear that? No harassment allowed, Mr. Attorney. Please, Your Honor. Very well. But this is your last chance, Mr. Wright. You may present one piece of evidence to the court. I only get one shot at this. If you cannot prove everything, it's over. For your client, and for... Wait, and for you. Do you fully understand? Yes, Your Honor. Uh, 
I'm sure you are well aware, Your Honor, but the cross-examination period has ended. Will you shut up? Shut your shut your mouth. Shut your mouth. Were you paying attention, Mr. Payne? Thank you for the save again. I said that Mr. Wright could present only one more piece of evidence. Oh. Now then, Mr. Wright, this is your last chance. I fell back asleep. Good morning again, Plum. Hurrah! If you can't do it, we are legally allowed to murder you. <laughs> oh. Pretty please, you wanna? <laughs> Pretty please? Pretty please? Uh. You'd think the judge would be used to right pulling this kind of bullshit in his house by now. For real. It all comes down to this. And it's go time. Wow, Plum, I'm so honored you fell asleep to my voice. I must be really soothing. <laughs> I feel like every time this happens, I say that every time. <laughs> Uh, your honor, the witness is a liar. Therefore, his pants are on fire. Yep, every time. Man, so many people's pants are on fire. Uh, what am I doing here? Please present everything with one... One piece. One piece! Yeah, your voice is super nice and soothing. <laughs> I don't know how to prove it. I proving it because you're a dick. Oh, another honor, honor today. Oh, what kind? What kind would you like? Hmm. Maybe while we're waiting, I need to figure out who the heck did this because, or why? Why? I don't know if I can prove it with a thing. I'm gonna be quite honest. In the pain objection, scream. Oh my god. Okay. Okay, let me do this. Let me push my microphone further away from my mouth. Ada, ada! <laughs> Is that good? Is that... OBJECTION! <laughs> there has been one piece of... You haven't shown yet. Is it the card? How is the business card? Prove... Oh! <gasps> Call your phone, please! Call your phone! Call it! Do it! <laughs> Is that the funny shit I've heard all month? <laughs> Why, thank you! How nice! Here, please, have one of mine! <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's written in fancy script. The ink is strong and clear, but I still can't read it. Yeah, baby! She's goaded! Wait, what am I doing? This isn't the time to be exchanging business cards. Your Honor, there is something very important about that card. And that is... The back of the card. The most soothing Arara. <laughs> the, most, we're just, the soothing voice. <laughs> this card is important because of what is on the back. Hmm? You wrote your cell phone number on the back, but... That's exactly it. Can you please call this number from your cell phone? Huh? Right now? But court is still in session. Your Honor, I have first edition Charizard. <laughs> Therefore, I win. <laughs> it's okay. You'll see. Okay, if you say so. Is the defense preparing something, Mr. Wright? Another Aura Aura? You guys have points to spend today. All the Aura Auras. Your Honor, this card is a regular card. It is a VMAX Mew Hollow card. It's a secret rare. It's gold and everything. Medium rare, please. Oh my God, what does that what does that mean? Do I, wait, does this mean you want me to say it like his objection voice or something? Or like ara ara? <laughs> Damn ad timing. Oh, I can wait for the ad. As I know, quite a few people are in an ad right now. I can wait for the Ara Ara for a couple minutes. Do -do -do, do -do -do -do. Medium rare Ara Ara, please make of that what you will. Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay, so medium rare is the fancy boy, fancy pants man. So I'm probably gonna do an Ara Ara just like that. 
And you have fancy pants, Aura Aura. Kate, welcome back. I'm back. I just took a nap. What happened? We are putting this man in jail. <laughs> we're at the end of the trial. Um, and we're about to do an Aura Aura, so we're gonna wait a little bit uh, for the ads to finish. Um, escaped ad hell. Is everyone back from ads? Is ads done? Rusted! Thank you for the gifts of the chaos. I appreciate it. Okay, ads are done. Everyone back? Okay. Get in here, chaos. <laughs> Thank you for gifting us some of the chaos. I really much appreciate it. Okay, here we go. Ada, Ada. Is that fancy pants enough? I don't know. Ada, Ada. <laughs> <laughs> That's good enough. <laughs> Are we going to call my cell phone? Or we're going to call my cell phone now. And get pants. Pat, 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 pat. Almost tomboy Ara Ara. See, I always thought of myself as a tomboy when I was young. Another one? <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, this is the Ara Ara stream. We can go like a month without an Ara Ara and then all of a sudden Ara 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 <laughs> Backwards Ara Ara This is the This is Ara <laughs> <sighs> I swear to god when I get 10k I'm gonna make you do the most flirty Ara Ara ever Do it Do it You gotta get there Let's do it Oh my god Another one I haven't even done the other one yet <laughs> Race car backwards Oh I see <laughs> Man, what a bunch of jokers. You're paying our Ara Ara taxes. And I'm late on my taxes. Today is the last day of taxes. If you haven't paid your taxes yet. You guys, are you kidding me? Another one? If everyone else is doing it, you feel left out. Okay, what was the first Ara? Backwards Ara Ara? Okay. Ara Ara. Can I try to make it sound backwards? You know how like when... um. Like, when you play a video backwards, you can, like, tell it's backwards. Um... Okay, I got, like, three RRs to do. <laughs> Another one! Guys, I can't even keep count. Hold on. I have... One, two, three, four left. Should I just... <laughs> I'm gonna pause the redeem. <laughs> I've never seen this before. Like, no one else has had, like, this many points all together like this. You guys really save your points. I have no idea how you would do it backward. I don't know. I like saying it while inhaling. Like saying it while inhaling? Oh. How <laughs> would that work? I mean, I can make Evian Day and turn on because you know 113,000. What? Do you guys want new redeems? <laughs> Do you guys want to do like new redeems? Like you guys will spend points. Or are you are you hell bent on? Uh, are you hell bent on uh, saving those points? Not doing our aura. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> oh wait. Ara 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 ara. I'm just gonna do them all. Hold on. How many more I have left? I have. I think I- I have one left? Ara, ara. Is that good enough? Am I done? <laughs> Am I done? Am I done with our auras? Am I- I did all of them are different. All of them. No more. <laughs> I'm still rebuilding my points since the, uh, I think it was the stream anniversary. Holy moly! Oh, that's true. You did spend a lot of points on the stream anniversary. This kills my entire soul. What is happening? Literally, everyone is- we redo we're doing the point redeem for RR, which is like really crazy expensive. And I'm don't know how people everyone has been saving up money for this. I'm just like, what the fuck guys? Thank you for wooing my freaking googly eyes. We are done. Are we done? Yes. We're done. <laughs> Back to Gaze Attorney. No, I think you got three more. I don't believe you. No, I don't believe you. No, no, no. I was gonna say, I remember I left off at um I think I remember leaving off at the the rusted, and then I did the Indeed. four after that or whatever. I could I could be wrong. I don't know. I've done a lot of RRs today. I don't know. <laughs> I've done a lot of nyas. 
Can I get a Nya <laughs> Redeem? Dude, we had a Nya Redeem earlier. We just can go on Minyanya. <laughs> Thank you for the head path. <laughs> I appreciate it. And then the court will see everything for what it is. Of all the idiotic, stupid things to... Oh, let's go! Let's go! It's samurai theme! Uh, what? What is my phone? And what is this stupid sounding ringtone? What do you mean? This is the best ringtone I've ever heard in my life! You can't harp on the steel samurai like that. Like, what the fuck? No, it stopped! Beep. Beep. Mr. Medium Rare. <laughs> hmm. How strange. I can almost swear that you're holding my phone. Guilty! <laughs> Jail with ye! <laughs> Guilty just for that. How dare you make fun of Steel Samurai. You are. Ah! No, 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 no! It can't! By the way, before I forget, thank you very much for the lump on my head this morning. <laughs> No. No. <laughs> Still Samurai theme is one of the best. Prove me wrong. It's it seriously is. It's so good. I don't think I need to explain any further, except to say When you went to retrieve your cell phone, you mistakenly took the wrong one. <laughs> oh, oh no. Breathe! No! <laughs> no! As soon as the face starts changing color, I start getting scared. I'm like, no, please! You no, know, you can't escape that easily. You need to go to jail. <laughs> so it, that is what happened. You were knocked out by Mr. Wellington. He is a man who lives on his pride and self-image alone. And in order to hide his involvement with the con artist group, he, was be he has become paranoid and has lost all ability to make rational judgments. Life death, life death, life death, life death. Hmm. Then, then Mr. Wright, the phone you're holding. It's Mr. Wellington's, naturally. <coughs> Speaking of that man, how is he, Mr. Payne? Uh, he was arrested and <laughs> he's been taken away, Your Honor. Very well. Now then, this court finds the defendant, Maggie By Bird Bite. I keep saying Bride every time. Maggie Bird, not guilty. Let's go! <laughs> Blue lobster jump scare. <laughs> this game just turned into, <laughs> into a stuff film. <laughs> that is all. This court is adjourned. Let's freaking go! Three cases to go. Let's go! Oh, I'm so happy. I knew that the real you would shine through eventually. I'm so moved by what you've done for me, sir. Brain damage! Thank you so much, Mr. Wright. I feel really bad for Dustin. He didn't do anything to deserve this. It's probably because of me. Huh? My whole life has been nothing but a whirlwind of bad luck and failures. What is her connection to Gumshoe, though? We never learned. If you guys know if there is a connection, don't tell me. Um, especially if it tells me later in the game, I don't want- I want to be surprised. But if we're never going to see her again, then I'm like, hmm. Um, your whole life? It can't be that bad, can it? Since I was six months old, when I fell from the- no the ninth floor of my apartment building. Oh, man. Are you good? How does she live? I feel like you only can live through, like, two stories, right? Like, if it's a third story, you're kind of breaking a leg or whatever. I was born with glass bones and paper skin. Every night I lay awake until my heart attacks put me to sleep. Man, that guy... 
poor guy. That's SpongeBob, right? Uh, without any spoilers, they're both cops. That's their connection. Okay. Uh, <laughs> uh, I fell from a ninth floor of my apartment building. I've been hit by all sorts of vehicles, gotten sick from all sorts of foods, failed at almost every test I've ever taken, experienced almost every kind of disaster. Bro, give her a break! I never won an even or even tied at a game of tic-tac-toe. My life has really been nothing but a string of disasters. That is, uh, pretty bad. Up until I went to college, I was known as the goddess of misfortune. But then, at the academy, everyone called me the Lady Luckless. Lady Luckless. Lady Luckless? Anime Rummy? <laughs> Yeah, they're just really falling off a mountain. <laughs> How do you not tic-tac-toe? I think she just loses tic-tac-toe way too much. She just puts all her X's and O's in the wrong spots. The guy she like died too. Poor guy. How do you not tie at least? She's just don't don't yell at her. She's just a little guy. <laughs> What's worse is that my misfortune always seems to latch onto those around me. Get away from me! Do not hug her! <laughs> Do not! No, 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 no. Couldn't even get pity ultras in any gotcha I played. Ah! No, get out of my game, pain. We want to see redacted. Redacted. You can black out and go limp. That's how most people survive falls like that? Oh. Interesting. Run away! Run away! I feel bad for her. I do want to give her a hug. What do you mean? When I see someone in trouble, I always try to help. Ah, that's right. You were talking about this earlier. It happened again recently, too, sir. There was an old lady... Uh oh <laughs> Pacing back and forth by the pedestrian crosswalk. I gave her my hand, and... Before I knew it, we were having dinner at my house. What... Oh. I'm sure that Dustin's gone because of me. Wait, what? You came into her house? Did you just take her away? Did you kidnap a lady? I thought that she was gonna get hit by a car! Or like, I thought... <laughs> and you said, I took her to my house. <laughs> I'm so confused right now. <laughs> What's the translation of that? I wonder. There was an old lady at the crosswalk, so I suplexed her right there. I have such bad luck. I suplexed an old lady. <laughs> we are all equally are confused. No trunk coon today. <laughs> I'm sure that Dustin's gone because of me. That's not true. My glove didn't even have any sort of special meaning. It was just a present to say thanks for covering one of my, my night shifts. Wait, are you actually dating him or not? Oh, I see. Everything is all my fault. Dustin's death. Your head being all messed up. Oh, well, I don't think my head is that messed up yet. The old lady imposed herself on Bird and made her give her support. <laughs> Life support. <laughs> Stole Grandpa's girl. Mrs. Steel, your girl. <laughs> I'm gonna find a new life for myself starting now. Next time we meet, I'm sure I'll... I'm sure I'll have found a whole ocean's worth of good luck by then, sir. Please tell me you're gonna become a marine biologist. But then don't sink the ships, please. Oh my god, that'd be horrible. Oh my gosh. No supper like dinner. <laughs> yeah, after all, Gotham Misfortune is only a name. You bet. I'm gonna make it, I promise. Next time we meet, I'll only be an unlucky person instead of a goddess. Okay, but what's wrong with being a goddess? Being a goddess is cool. Oh, that's wild. Some mad bat, mad bastard suplexed my grandma today. <laughs> and she was crossing the road. What the bird? How dare. I don't even, how could she? So messed up. She became a marine. <laughs> Does she really? That's the spirit. Well, Mr. Wright, Maya. I should get going. Okay. Good luck to you. 
Ever even a whale breach and land on a ship? That'd be your ship. <laughs> I'm on a whale. I'm inside the whale. Vol, thank you for the lurk. I appreciate it. Hope you're having a good day and a good weekend. Thanks. You take care of yourselves too. Oh, what a horrible day. I got my memory back, but things are still a little fuzzy. But you're okay, and that's what counts. You really had me worried. Come on, let's go back to the office. Did we even explain to her that we had memory loss? Hmm, I'm afraid to ask, but here goes. So, this might sound bad, but, uh, uh who are you? What? I thought you said you got your memory back! Oh god, we're gonna have to meet her all over again. At that moment, everything really did come back to me. Gumshoe! Detective Gumshoe? He's someone I've had clashes with in the past during certain cases. But he's also a really good ally during others. Fuck! <laughs> the judge. He's a lovable, kind old man who is easily swayed by other people's opinions. But in the end, he always comes up with the right verdict. This person. <laughs> I haven't got a clue. He seems to know me, but maybe he's mistaking me for someone else. I may have got my memories back, but only the important ones. Sorry, Maya. <laughs> and this girl, Aya? You... You finally remembered. This is Maya Faye, my assistant. That's right. And I have so many unforgettable memories about her. For example... Uh, <laughs> um. <laughs> I mean, she's not Emma. I miss Emma. <laughs> I love Maya, but oh my god, I, I miss Emma. <laughs> Earth to Nick! What's wrong? You keep staring at me. Don't tell me you've missed me. So did she actually, like, come back? Like, she was away and then came back for this trial or something, right? Because she keeps saying, like, oh, you missed me, all that stuff. For example, when she was blamed for murder. <laughs> Maya, don't stop committing murder, you silly guy. Uh, well, yeah, I suppose I have. I feel like I haven't seen you in ages. Oh? Well, I'm back now, so it's time for us to create new memories together. I guess I'll find out. Don't commit a new crime, please. She went to go to train for a year last time. Yeah. I didn't think she'd come back right then and there. Like, y'all forgot. No, I remember she went to go train, but I thought she'd still be at training and she wouldn't just come back to be like, hey, you asked for this. Like, dude, she, she must have come back like yesterday because she even saw us like cleaning the phone of the, of the sand and stuff. All right, sounds good. All the phone numbers on my phone were erased by Mr. Well Done. I guess I have to start over from the very beginning. Come on, Nick. Let's go to our usual burger joint. Okay, okay. Actually, it hasn't even been that long since she came back into my life. And that story? That story began on one rainy afternoon two months ago. Wait, who? 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 Her? <laughs> Is it her? Is she? Is she two months ago? Okay. Man! Save. We'll save that one, though. It's different colors, so I can tell. Dang, we did it. We got through the first episode. Child! <laughs> Okay, we're going to end stream there. That seems like the perfect spot to end. Uh, next time we'll be streaming Ace Attorney Week next Monday, so be sure to join us for then if you're interested in Ace Attorney. Um, next time we'll be live, though. Uh, we'll be on Wednesday at 3 p.m. EDT. Cookie! Thank you for the follow. Much appreciated. Thank you, thank you. Monday. Monday. Uh, but yeah, next time I'll be live. I forgot. I'm gonna Google the eyes, Ron. Next time I'll be live will be um, on Wednesday at 3 p.m. We'll be playing some more Pikmin 2. 
not beating the game. I'm so salty. <laughs> I'm so salty about that. Um, let me find somebody to raid really quickly. But thank you everyone for watching. I really appreciate it. I had a lot of new faces today. It was good to meet everybody. Everybody new. And it was good to see everyone returning faces as well. Let me see. Let me see. Oh, wait. Have we raided out this person before? We probably did. I think we did. We could do it again. <laughs> we could do it again. Um. Yeah, let's go ahead and do it. Um. Do, 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 do. Okay, like I said, everybody, uh, if you want to participate in the raid, please copy the sub raid message if you are a subscriber. If you are not a subscriber and you are just a follower, please copy the normal raid message. Um, I think that was done up above. Uh, if you scroll up a little bit, this was fun. Suki, thank you for sticking around. Good to see you. Um, like I said, whoop. I could have came back to here. <laughs> I could have came back to the just chatting stream. <laughs> and actually had music instead of doing it in silence. Um, but yeah, again, thank you everybody so much for hanging out. I really much appreciate it. Thank you guys for all the support today. And thank you for the RRs. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, and yeah, like I said, I'll see you guys on Monday. Or Monday? <laughs> thank you guys. <laughs> I'll see you on Wednesday. And if you're here for this turn, I'll see you back on Monday. Goodbye, guys. Goodbye. Goodbye. Make sure you treat uh, the person rating too with a lot of love and respect as much as you'd show me. And I'll see you guys then. Bye! Bye 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 bye! Go! Oh.